It's time for Marvel! All right, let's get this show started. We are your host for this evening. I'm IMC Yipes, of course, the and on the right of me. Magus, one, two, three, four. Yipes, I, I'm so excited right now. This is going to be crazy, man. This is uh, going to be nuts. Thanks for Tragic with that crazy intro. Yes, this guy's yes, been yes. the voice of Evo. And well, hot nuts. minutes. That is yeah, true. you saved the day, Yipes. So I got to say thank you. Uh, yeah, no problem. No you problem. came through. I know, uh, it's, you know it's been a long weekend for all of us, but thanks a lot, man. Yep, yep, yep. Here we <laughs> go. We got Mexico's final hope right now from all of us, Capcom 3. That's right. And one of the things we can say about this guy is he's the one MODOK left in this top eight. You, you brought up some points to me earlier off stream about how people should approach MODOK. What do you think he's got to do to beat him? I mean, right now, Y2J has ground characters. He has nothing really to support him in the air. So right now, what he got to do is be as patient as possible and wait for him for his right, for his, uh, right time to attack. I mean, he's just chilling up there, dropping bombs. The Wolverine can't get up there. I think he might have should have picked Spencer first. You know what? Maybe a better idea is to start Magneto also. Right, because we were talking about using Super Jump Hypergraph. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, Bruxy, a.k.a. Mexamo, just took uh, Wolverine out, no problems. Now this is going to be a problem. Wow. Look at the protection. Wow. wow. It's the Sloman Shield. <laughs> and uh, Y2J is looking lost. Uh, what's your favorite movie, Spencer? He's getting blown up. He's getting, he's getting analyzed right now. Modoc, he's doing the smart thing though, and uh, Fruitsy's sitting on the lead, so he can literally just up back all the way to the top of the screen and hang out. Right here, he gotta make the most of it and, keep, and stay on him. You know what I noticed about these Mexican players is their defense is so good. Yeah, pretty solid, yep, indeed. Nice. Man, yeah, that's what we saw them, my man. They, they, they start sleeping and they get hit. Yep. That's... Okay, now he got a better chance right here. Oh, uh, unnecessary X Factor there, but it's okay. He really just tried to force something to happen and nothing came to him right there. Wow, and here just we go. killing that X Factor, okay. A lot of players are saying Modoc really uh, counters a lot of the cheap stuff in this game of you, you know, for next nice uh, Morgan Doom. Morgan Doom, Virgil, X Factor, all that stuff. He does really well in avoiding it. I think the best answer to Modoc is like a character maybe like Hawkeye, Dormammu. Right. I think yeah. Dormammu is probably a hard counter for him. But here we go, Magneto's going to die, no problem. Why two J's taking that bump, just not respecting the slow machine. Yeah, why two J's got to figure something out. Learning how to do a matchup in three games isn't easy, but he's really got to figure something out. So three out of five, so he can take his time. I should think he's start Magneto, though. I think so, too, or at least Spencer. Because you can yeah. do up grapple and stuff like that on the ground, see how that works out. Yeah. Well, I played Dyer back in New York. Shout out to the house. Right? They pretty much, uh, when they hold up, None of his grapples can reach. Oh, really? Nah, it doesn't, it doesn't reach against Moldock. So here we go, Fruitsy, all the way from Mexico, taking game number one. Yeah, yeah, and yesterday he was all smiles. Today, look at him, man. He looks stone He's cold serious. right there. Still playing on a Mastic, too. Yeah, I respect a that. A custom. That takes, ass. that takes me back. Yep, straight chop the tree and put some buttons yeah, in Yeah, it. it makes a good a bench, too, when you're not playing it. All right, got him right there. And he's just going to do this again, because Wolverine doesn't oh, really... Nice. Oh, that's a, that's a good try, though. Nice. Ooh, getting a little too impatient right there. Yeah. Why 2 j might get punished for it. And like you said, Fruity's really just punishing people for being impatient. Yeah, yeah. Like you said earlier, man, they're waiting for that one shot, you know what I mean? If they don't get that one shot, they get punished real hard. Right. Just like that. That's like 80% right there. Ooh, look at Elvis. Look at him go, and he got a mic. You <laughs> know, I just noticed that yesterday he got a mic. Oh, yeah, that's right, he does. <laughs> He is from uh, the, the Mojo world, I think, where uh, like the whole thing is like entertainment. And wow, nice block, dude. And yeah, you're right. That up grapple he tried to shoot right there only ended about midway. Oh, oh the slow machine shield. 
Ooh, oh, got right him. Here we go. He's got to hit him. Oh, Nice. Ooh, right on the head, dude. Make this count. Oh, what? Does that, that work? Was... Oh, okay. Let him know that. That's fine. He cut it really short. He's going to end up right here. Magneto to guard MC. Here we go. Modoc down. Now we got a real match. I think Y2J really needed that to be in this game. Yep, yep, yep. Just to know that he could kill Modoc. So right now, Fruit Fruit and Y2J look just about even. Yeah, I know. This, this is going to be tough for Captain America. He's not going to win the zoning fight, but that's why he's going to be calling Taskmaster a lot. It's tough to yeah, prevent yeah. Magneto just from doing uh, disruptive. Yeah, that's pretty much Fruity's game, and he's trying to clip him with the shield and get a full combo to a death finish. Nice. That's a pretty sneaky team he has, you know. Yeah. Oh, there he goes. Caught him slipping with the try jump. And it's he okay, can make though. that safe with the DAC and Taskmaster, too. Nice. Oh, got him. Pick him up. Oh. oh. He can punish him right here. Oh, nice. He had an X Factor. YGJ had to do all that. That was bad. Why? Bad decision. Yeah, why would you do that? Oh, another bad decision by Fruitsy. The plane that a Evo nervous. stage. Yeah, the plane a little nervous, man. Ooh. Yeah, I would not call an assist. Got the counter hit. That was a bait. Yeah. Got baited. He could have X Factor to kill them. They're playing really nervous out there, yeah. Playing it real safe. We got 24 seconds on the clock. Right now, Y2J should take some approaches with a command throw. Yeah, he should really just dash in there. It looks like Fruits is staying on the ground more. Oh, he is running. Yeah. And he's still got a full X Factor on deck. Hey, yeah, so it looks like he took that uh, that wave back dash from you, man. Uh, yeah, man, that's, that's one of the best approaches to get in this game. If you want to get a lot of space, that's one of the best things you have to do. Yeah, it's just a little more difficult than doing it uh, than the front one. Yeah, so here we go. Why today look like he's having fun, though? He's like, all right, guy, you want to run away? I got you right uh, now. So I think he's going to start Magneto. He should. He should. He should start Magneto. It looks like he's thinking of the complete. No, he's going to do it. Okay, he's going right back to it, huh? And Brucey looking real strong right now. You know, and another thing, like how we were talking about how Modoc's flying away and stuff like that counters so much. Everybody always says, like, Wolverine's the best character in the game for the first five seconds. Right, right, right. If, right, you, can, right, if right. you can survive that onslaught, then he's like, whatever. That's so true. look at this. Like, he doesn't he already survived chance, it. Yep. He already survived it. Oh, man. You know, I, I, I swear, I think this is a carnival act. When you start hearing this music, I'm getting trolled right now. <laughs> I know, man. I, I can't like take this character right seriously, but he's actually a good character. Like, he's actually really good. Really good, man. He's one of the characters I said. Him and X-23 are pretty good. I very slept on. And just nobody. And Firebrand's kind of like that, too. And, oh, there you go. Ooh. And he drops it. Should have hit him with a roll launch. Right. Oh, there we go. Okay, so he still has it. YGJ at all costs wants to kill this mode off. Ooh. Oh, oh, man, got Cliff for it. He got hit by that jump ass. And he's getting DAC. Yep. He's not going to do much here. Oh, you can get oh, some out of wow. that. Wow. Okay. It leaves him in that uh, floating state. Oh, I see. I didn't even know that. That's that. Learn something new every day. Yeah, no kidding. Uh -oh. Got the knockdown. He's going to finish off Wolverine. That's Captain Mexican. Remove the A from the forehead and just put an M. There's actually a Photoshop of that out already. Oh, really? <laughs> About, yeah, for this guy's team. Yeah, it's really funny. Okay, he should make it count right here. The this relaunch. Is tough, though. Ooh. I mean, nice even stretch. if he kills Captain America, he still doesn't have the X Factor, and he's going to be losing a lot. Oh, nice there we reset. Go. A little risky, but you know what? He needed it's a that. game, yep. Because he, he knows he's got the X Factor. Oh, should have saved the meter. Could have picked him up and saved it, but it's okay. Finish the play. Here we go. Moda coming in. Kind of a weak oncoming game right there. So right now, Y2J, all you got to do is just sit back and relax and just dodge and weave, and there won't be a real problem here. Oh, Don't nice. give him all he wants. Here it goes. Nice. Oh, great counter by Boots. He's got really good movement, I've noticed. His wave dash back is good. His forward wave dash is solid. There we go. Oh, there we go. There we go. Mike J's going to knock him down, pick him up. Doesn't waste any of his bounces. Should do the super right now. He right. got one more OTG. Into the wall bounce. He should finish it right here. Yep. In your face. Nice. With the zigzag finish. OK, Y2J still in the game. Here comes Magneto. Yep, he's got the DAC to finish it off. Is that going to be enough? Oh, okay. That's nice. Very nice. Very nice. nice. Right, CJ hanging on strong right there. It's 2-1. Two, it's two, Gucci's on game point right now. That's right. Spencer really opened up his whole team right there. He just needs to kill Modoc. That approach works. Look at this guy. I'm just, I feel like I'm getting trolled right now. It's just a, it doesn't seem like a real character in a fighting game. Wow. So dive kick combo really doesn't really work on Modoc. Like, oh, oh, barely worked right there. Combos are very awkward on Modoc. Oh, and wow. he just got a happy birthday right there. Elise Kukwanya with a double team, threw the booger at him, and, oh. and the power that Captain America. That, yeah, 90% down to Wolverine. He's a, 
running out of health. Hard tax is special, it's very risky. He gets punished for it. He's going, he's going in. He's extending this combo. Yeah, this one's gonna hurt. Pick him up. Oh, watch your step. Oh man. Oh, Ooh, nice block. Reset. Oh, that was a sick dash under though. He just didn't capitalize. Oh, nice. Ooh, nice, nice, nice there's nice that up grapple. This is a little more even than it looks. There nice we go, dead right. character. Yep. Oh, that was not a good look. That's so bad for Y2J. He may have thrown away his tournament chances on that grab alone. Oh, he went for the Ooh, air grab right there. confirmation, but got him again. Oh, it ain't over. He should finish it off right here. Ooh. Nice. Here and we here go. we go. What so does he go he for have? the guard break. What? Wow. <laughs> what was that? Dash my yoink. Yeah, that's oh, a get him. Ooh. Got him. Is he going to pick up? Nope. So right now, he should have pressed oh. him. Oh. should have pressed him on the ground. Yeah. Taskmasters yeah. are known for holding up back, but you know what? Fruitsy takes it. Yeah. Mexico lives on right now. He lives on. And you know what? There's, we might have like a real a dream match coming up, which could be a potential Chris G versus Fruitsy. And I think oh, that yeah. would be really sick to see what Chris G has found out to defeat more. Because I know after that one big two where he lost to die, he's probably been thinking up some ways to beat it. Well, hopefully if it goes down. Because right now, Chris G got to go through the Wasper. Man, okay. The, the marvelous one. Yeah, this is kind of a kind of a crazy storyline to this because you know Justin was so dominant in the East Coast for years, moved over to the West Coast, and kind of Chris G kind of took that right, mantle. Yeah, yeah. You know, he did. He, was, he did. He was kind of the new, uh, the new not king, but he's like the new dominant force. The new, the new grind time. Right, the new grind guy. You know, yeah. and this is kind of going to make a statement. That you're like, where where have we both come? You know, it's true. What has Justin become since he left the East Coast? It's true. Does the East? I gotta ask you. Did, does the East Coast still consider Justin East Coast? Is he well, in terms of his close friends, yes. Yeah. In terms of his close friends. But, I mean, pretty but much anybody that wants coast. to break his, want to eat his head up, they're like, he's West Coast now, yeah. you know. But, now nah, I still think to me, you know, Justin Wong is one of my closest friends. He's my brother, so I consider him Justin Wong. That's pretty much it. I just feel like most of his skills and learning and everything came from the East Coast. So, I just, you know, I always consider him Of East course. Coast. But you know what, though? Hey. When he went to the West, I've noticed a lot of changes in his gameplay. So he's gotten very solid. In a good way. In a good way, yeah. Okay. yeah. So he really upped his game once he pulled. And okay. I could see, you know? Yeah, so not knocking the East. Because when I went to the West, I got a little stronger, too. <laughs> yeah, hey, we, the we could do that, man. Yeah. And that fighting game TV house, don't stay there too long or you might never lose again. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> but so, uh, do you want to tell me who you think they're going to pick? Because these guys can play a lot of characters. So I already know off jump. Justin and Wong is not picking Wolverine against Morgan. That's that is happening. a bad match. Wolverine, hands down. So he is definitely going to go with Spencer versus Frank West in this one. What about Spencer, though? Like, does he really do well versus? I don't think he does well versus. You Spencer. know what it is? The the, the 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 mind game is that since he has the bionic arm, right? Chris, he has no choice but to respect him up close, you know, and play it very safe. So that gives more time for Justin to figure out how to land a okay. hit, so especially just, since he has Frank West assist. Right. So on paper, he may not necessarily do great versus Morgan, but the reality is he has a random bionic arm, always cocked and ready. Exactly. So Chris, exactly. he's going to respect that. He doesn't want to run into that. And exactly. So and at the same time, if he gets two meters, just he can always bionic arm into swords, and he can always get him a free mix. Right. Up. I wonder if Justin practiced that glitch at all. Oh, what is this? Wesker, Ryu. Oh, so, so, Chris, so Chris G gave up on the match, I guess. Is he going to Hawkeye and he's going to play his old school team? Yeah, looks like it. You know I what? don't he, think that's a good idea. He I, had I, a lot of success earlier, though. Yeah. Wow, this is not a good idea. I feel like you're right, though. He did do well yesterday, but I really wanted to see him play what made him, you know, so dominant. And that's right. I think Chris G's basing this on the CEO. Because uh, Justin Wong defeated uh, Chris G at, at CEO when Chris G had his Morgan team. So maybe. He probably had to sit down Maybe. with himself and thought about it. I don't know. I just kind of feel like at this point, at Evolution Losers Bracket, you go with your money team. Yeah, not with some no, gambles. No, you're right, you're right. But here we go. Let's see how this goes down. It might Ooh, be a good man. decision. Okay, here we go. Round one. So, Spencer versus Ryu. This is pretty, pretty good for Spencer. Uh, he's just going to, yeah, be able to. Oh, wow. no. He clipped him out. And that is the Chris G special. Yeah, this may be the whole match right here, but don't ever call Justin out. Oh. Gonna get the oh, S. Oh, yeah, here he's comes Wesker. All the way. Oh, he can punch him right here. Here we go, here we go. Wow. Oh, all right. He's gonna do the jump, jump. Yep, full combo, full bread and butter. So he couldn't kill Spencer, and that may be one of those ghost characters that come and haunt you later. Smart move, smart decision there by Justin Wong. How do you Holds feel it. about that mix up? I don't really like that mix up. It's not really a mix up, he just knows it would have not killed him. 
So he well, might as well go for the mix-up. Well, he does high tide, you know, and then trick, and then he leaves you in the air and does swords. I don't like that. Why doesn't he knock you down to do swords? You know, well, I guess it gives him more of a chance for them to, to come down pressing a button. All right, all right, that's true. Well, it worked out either way. Got him, cancels in the supers, good damage. Wow. Not enough, though. And Justin Wall came back with the greatest white boy of all time, Virgil. Yeah. Hey, he's making waves at this tournament. That's true. Okay, caught him with the random cross up. Yeah, he got his glasses off, too. No air throw right there. Chris G respects Justin Wong's tech game really yeah, well. Yeah. He you knows what, it, he'll tech the air throw. And Justin Wong's in a little bit of trouble right now because he got no meter, no really good assist. Yeah, Virgil needs meter. So does Spencer. Yeah. Well, Spencer, I don't know. Not as much, but he, he could use it. And Chris G looking extra solid. Both of these players are looking extra solid right now. Lots of respect right here. So right now what Justin Wong is, he wants him to come in so he can, he can block and obtain meter at the same time. Right, and Virgil actually, like in these full screen positions, not a very good character. He needs to be about three quarters mid-range, yeah. and then he can fight. Fire off the judgment cuts. Right, judgment cuts, standing heavy and stinger. Those are going to be his main weapons. Then, of course, Helmbreaker, but Chris T looks like he's not falling for he's anything. Not falling. Oh. He's just fighting the space. Wow, with a whiff stinger right there, he really could have ended Virgil's life. Right. This is so, they're playing so patient. You can tell this is for Evo right there. Caught him with a counter hit. He is busting that gun, that samurai edge. Got him. Trying to activate with the sword, but it ain't over. Here comes the bionic man with the bionic plan. Oh, Spencer. Wow, that looked like an NBC two car break right there. So nice and simple. Nice and clean. Now, Justin might just pick the Wolverine. Why? Because that team's actually good for this team. Oh, no, he's going Oh, he's running the, it back. Yeah, he's running it he's back. Running back. He's not packing it up. Not yet. Start of the match. Whoa, wow. with a roll launch. <laughs> what a gamble. S. This is Vegas. I have no idea what he was thinking. Like, what oh. was that? Here we go. This is a lot of this is a lot of damage loss right here. Oh, 80k. Yep, I know. 80k. 160k gone. And you get that unscaled finisher right here. Ooh. Oh, zigzag. Oh, he kept it simple. I don't think he knows how to do it on Ryu. Right. This is gonna go with another level one. Gets the pick up for the mix-up. No, he doesn't do it. Wow. Whoa! Nice! <laughs> get him off me! Oh, he got Frank. Frank is hurt. Uh, we got Hawkeye now. How does this match pan out? Looks good for Hawkeye. Pretty good, pretty good. Especially if you have better assists. Oh. Yeah, Ryu and Wesker are not very good assists for Hawkeye. Oh, wow, nice. Nice recovery there by Justin. Nice break. He said, release me. Yeah, Justin's going to finish this right here. He could DAC to kill him. Nice and basic. Nice and clean there by Justin Wong. He's doing good. And right into the swords. We see two jump down hards. All right. Nice and basic. Round this is nice and clean. Another another worldly tour. Oh, we going to level up. Nice. You know, Frank. a lot of times I ask, why is Frank on this team? And right. that's why. And then you get the reminder. And then you get the reminder. So Frank West is a god now. He was Frank Wack at level one. Now he is Frank West. Now he's ridiculous. That's right. He gets a defense modifier. He does more damage. He gets better weapons. He gets a new super, a roll. He's a completely different character. And he got more phone for his camera. <laughs> that's right. And here come the zombies, too. Okay. Not much there. Chris G a little desperate. Oh, just wants to pull West for him. All right. So let's see. Ooh. Oh, that would have been a nice pull there. Yeah. There's some tricks to punish things when you do counters like that. You X-Factor them and then dash. Ooh, and he oh, lost Frank West. West. Oh, made him flinch. X-Factor, yep. You get rid of Virgil when you get the chance. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Chris G. Chris G looking strong right now. Justice in trouble. Here comes Spencer. How's he going to waste X-Factor? Nice. Wow. Nice cross this up. I like that. Wow. I like that. that was he caught him slipping. It was real slipping. Yep, yep, man. He caught him slipping right It was there. actually like a counter X-Factor, too, because he did like a move that puts you in light block stun. So if he tried to X-Factor out of it, he might have just gotten like a, 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 a loose X-Factor, not in guard. Right, 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 right. So then Chris G would have been able to And here we go. Him. This is what I was calling earlier. You're Go right, on. but he's putting himself into a corner this way. Yeah, now if he wins now, then he's bringing out more. Again. Absolutely. And that's going to be tough. Chris G taking a moment to collect himself. He knows what time it is. He is at the Evo stage. Remember last year he made top 16, pretty close to making it. But he lost to, I think, Clockwork. I forgot who else. Yeah, I don't know. He came close, though. I mean, Chris G is putting in the work. It's good to see him, you know, be up here in top eight. With yeah. first Justin, really good match right here. Pretty much, yeah, yeah he, he definitely deserved it, man. All, all those tournament yeah, points, all does, those points man. that He's he gained. He's a good player. He's a cool dude. I just, I, about Justin, though, I'm, I always wonder, when's he really going to pick up a team that is, like, considered a top-tier team, you know? Remember, this is this is what I say. This game, is it only has a year and change. Yeah, right. 
So, you don't, know, you down, down don't you sense those 10 characters already? Yeah, exactly. I do agree. That's all I'm saying. But we'll, we'll see. Great air tech right there. He matched the Swiss cheese. Justin has something with that Swiss cheese when he tech throws. He does it on purpose. No, I think he's just trying to match the break. No, he does. But if, if they're doing it too, the Swiss cheese will hit him and he gets a full combo. Well, that's true. That's true. Nope. I think he can clip him right here. Oh, okay. Yeah, he went for a uh, dive kick instead. Nice. Wow. Nice so hard, yeah, so hard to hit your opponent when your assist is getting comboed. I think Akuma's gonna hit him right here. Oh, nope. No GHC. Yeah, that was time. a bad decision right there. I think at this point, if Chris G loses, he's like, all right, whatever, because he feels pretty com comfortable right now. Right, because he can go to Morgan. Yeah, but Justin's no slouch. Definitely not a slouch. Yeah, his Akuma's gaining health fast, so that was good to waste X Factor early. Uh, got clipped by those chocolate us. Here we go. Down, Chris G plus assist. Oh, oh. Wow. <laughs> Justin really thought that was going to kill him. Chris G's going to let Hawkeye die, it looks like, or get a combo. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wow, body. Here we oh, go. that was a nice assist punish. I like that. Yeah, he really wanted Akuma out of there. It seemed like Chris focused on killing Akuma the whole time. Nice pressure right here. Nice pressure right there, yep. Just keeping him in that corner. He knows Wolverine's not too scary full screen, so he'll move in when he has a chance to dip back out. Oh, yeah, that's nice, all nice. he has to worry about is the Wolverine, or as, as Hawkeye, Wolverine's only move that is going to bug him is that Berserker Slash. And all the way back out. No punish. That oh, move is safe. Nice. Yep. Oh, he's chipping him. Wolverine's right. going to have to back it up right now. Uh-oh. People Dang. think it's like Akuma's and it's unsafe, but it's not. It's very safe. Here comes a Roro. That is Justin Wong's last chance right now because Clint's aim is on point. No X Factor. Is Justin Wong going to get knocked out of this tournament? He's still got fighting him. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh. All up to Ryu versus Storm. Here comes the ordinary guy, Dry Ooh, you. No OTG. He does not have one, of course. Oh Storm my dancing around. God. Yes, both these guys are so good at spacing and the neutral game. This is what they excel at. If the next hit is going to define Ooh, this match, Justin. And there gets it goes. It. As soon as you speak. The next hit decided by Justin. Here comes that weather. Make it rain, baby. It's gonna work. Not dead yet. 20 seconds on the clock. Ooh, what a whirlwind. Classic Marvel 2 finish right he just there. Does it. Very risky. You could have jumped. Kept the class of himself on. Here we go. Straight to the switch. Justin Wong knows the situation here. And his mouth is open. He's breathing. I think he's nervous. I mean, Justin's a vet, man, but come on, he gets nervous too. We all do. Everybody does. Yep. Look at Chris G. He is amped. Haven't shaved either. That's how you know he's grunting. Right. He's been in a cave just yeah, playing ball. Yeah, you know what time it is. We go. Okay, okay. Wow, he sticks. Oh, no, he goes oh! to Morgan. Oh, no. Oh, could have finished it off right there. But it was good damage already. So wait a minute. Let's and see. right, just as we said, yeah, he switches to Morgan. So we already know what Chris is gaming. He's going to land that air combo and go for the TAC combo right. to get that meter for Morgan. And here we go. Nice, oh, nice. He just needs three levels, and we're going to see a three-way DAC all the way to Morgan. Oh, there we go, Justin Scheming. Yep. Very good neutral game right here. Oh, Swiss cheese. Oh, school. What oh. just happened? Wow, Chris G is winning the air grab game over and over again. But Justin you know, he knows Justin is, is thirsty for the dive kick. Oh, okay, right. Uh-oh, here we go, problem. And here she comes. Here comes T and Tamara. Yep. It's going to hail to buy time. It's yep, going to yep, kill yep. about half the time. And then he's going to fly away and float down. That's right. Kill as much time as he can. But those missiles, he, he's going to take them, you know? He's like, I'm going to have to eat them. Uh-oh. Uh, this is meter. This isn't even about damage. This is all about meter. He does some pretty excellent damage. Though. Oh, nice. Nice break. Yeah. The legs time. exposed. This is huge if he kills Morgan. Oh, my God. Justin Wong. Is that going to be enough? Yeah, it's a wrap. It's a wrap. Pack it up. Oh, the last, the last, the last hail. The last icicle. Yep. <laughs> Got him. Oh, yeah. Justin going to play a patient game now. He's not even oh, trying yeah. to get next to, next to Dr. Doom. Dr. Doom can make comebacks, though. Here comes Doom. And he's going to... Christy has to decide how he's going to approach this match. Is he going to rush in there or try and chip him for 50 seconds? A little bit of both. A, a mix of both. Yeah, a little bit of both. Because he is trying to land the Levathian stomp. Yeah, he is, of course. But he's going to have to cut the screen off and get him to a corner before that starts working. Trying to buy a time, trying to kill that charge. Right. Here they come. Nope, not yet. Ooh. 
Uh, oh, Justin Wong gotta be careful. That was very risky. Yes, that was very risky. Oh, God. the late is gone. Oh, oh. And incoming mix up. He's gonna put some missiles and go for the high low. Wow, great cross up setup right there, but none of the missiles hit her. She says end of the line. Oh, wow, really? On a standing duel? There's that jump S. I think it just makes MVC2 players feel like it's MVC2 Storm. Yep, yep, yep. Even though her hard punch has a great hitbox too. Now Justin Wong with the excellent runaway. This is one of his trademark techniques right oh, here. Oh yeah, this is this is what he honed in the East Coast. Oh, oh no! Oh, oh, foot dive, pick him up. No meter needed. Oh my god, Magus. This is gonna be so tough. Magus. Oh, he's gonna try to kill some time right here. There's Ten seconds left, can he do it? Oh, oh, Justin, go sick. home! Ah! Ah! Oh, he got clipped! Chris oh. G hey, is going to send him home. Switch the chat. Turn up. Wow. I don't want to see Puma no more. That's huge for Chris G. And Chris G advances. That just says so much to Chris G. Look at him. He's, re he's sucking it all in right now. He's like, I just defeated Justin Wong. He's like, I need a, I need a razor. <laughs> That's what he's doing. He's like, I need a razor. Right. He's going to be in a business suit in a week. Like, he's uh. like, I'm done. That's it. <laughs> And Chris G takes it for New York City. Damn, shout out, shout out to the boys at, at Figure Cran for sending them out here. Oh, yeah, man. You know what? They're, they're good to their players. I'll yeah, give yeah, them that yeah, much. Sure, they're sure. good to their players. And Jago missing in action. I don't know where Jago's at, but whatever. Yeah, I heard I he's seen, Canadian now. I've see, I seen him uh, walking around Canadian. Yeah, that's I all see. I see. Like, like, even like the three Canadian tournaments. tournaments. Yeah. yeah, that's right. Okay, all right, so here we go. Right, let's check here comes this out the replay. Again. Now, as you can see, Justin Wong was playing very solid, but Chris G definitely was scheming. Caught him with the air grab, levate the and stomp. Oh. Oh. And what happened here? I gotta see it again. So There's you know what it is? When you see that that KO Ken and and rare and, and form, everybody just gets too jumpy. Yeah. You don't want to hit buttons either. You just want to try and block. Oh. Wow, caught him with the cross up right there Ooh. in the corner. Man. And, and he switches the channel. Cool <laughs> and he level that. three. He didn't have to level three. And hey, check this one out. This guy imprint. You know, this was one of your keep an eye on guys. Yeah, and yeah, look yeah, what yeah, happened, yeah, 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 yeah. Look I was saying happened. it. I was saying it because listen, I watch Thursday Night Run Back. I always watch it. Right, like, you can't miss it. Man. That's where that's where a lot of good Marvel players are. So I kept I kept an eye on imprint. You know, we talking there. I could see the hunger in this guy every time I see him play. You know, and he and he loses. He wins some, he loses some, but every time I see him lose, he always observes and he learns from it. He analyzes what he did wrong, goes home and tries to find a counter. Because I always see him the next week, like I see him beat the first, I see I see him lose to the guy he lost so they come back and beat the guy. That's a stronger. sign of somebody who wants to be a champion. Now right now, this is the first time he fights Flocker, and Flocker is oh. Right, but the big question is going to be here, you know, Flocker's already won majors. He's already proven himself as somebody to beat. Is yeah. Imprint ready to be a champion? Has he got it in him? And he's at a prime position right now. All he needs to do is win two matches, and he advances to the grand finals. So, so, how, Flocker how, also has are, a chance. Yeah, what are his chances for Flocker realistically, though? All right, now, in all honesty, Nova actually fights Zero very solidly. Oh, Since okay, he got wow. the shield, he has drones. He can really, he can really control the pace of the match. Yeah, the javelin might hit him out of the dashes in the air too. So there's some, he has some, uh, some unique moves that are going to work for zero. On the right, it's Flocker. And Flocker representing that Florida, aka Puerto Rico. Yeah, and he looks, he's got the face of a guy who plays Marvel all the time, man. Look at the true. bags under he his eyes. He don't sleep. He does not. That sleep. guy does not sleep. He just plays Marvel. He loops from, from breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Yep. <laughs> That's what he does. So here we go. Straight to the match. All right, let's see how this match pans out. This is one of those matches where I feel like the point character for Flocker is the biggest, it's, a, it's the biggest liability for him. He needs to kill it. Yep, yep, yep. Now, as you can see, as what I said, he's controlling the pace of the match wow. with the drone. First hit. Oh, he's going he's gonna to make him pack it up. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Nice. You know what they call, you know what they call him? He is ranked Centurion. Centurion. No, I'm serious. You read the comics? Oh, that's that is why. the highest rank. Oh, Centurion. That's why you hear him saying all those moves. Here comes Nova. Oh no, he's keeping him in. Oh, he missed nice. time. Wow. Nice fake out. It looked like a missed time. Came down, fell on that. Oh, oh, the, the swag. And the 80. Oh, the 80. 160 gone. Just like that. Hawkeye's about to be in trouble. Wow, this was really fast start for Imper. He's playing amazing. Oh, oh, six at another 80. 80. 80k body. All up to Dark Virgil. Ooh, nice Great mix up. up. Oh, but here come. Oh, oh. Very hard to deal with the X Factor 3 Virgil. 
Wow. Did it too close, Mr. Rap. Oh, he's getting snuck. It's a wrap. X Factor. Oh, no. Great oh, nice block. block. Great block. So California does have a lot of virgins, you know, good players like Richard Wynn. Right. So it has a lot of practice. Not as many as North Cal, but they got a couple good ones. Too. Yeah, 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 yeah. For sure. Oh, nice. This ain't over. He's going to fix up. Oh, oh, opened up. Yep. I know that's your teleport of choice, too. You don't like to go behind him as much, I've noticed. Yeah, yeah. you like to do the one right in front. Yeah, uh, uh. Uh oh, Gold Ranger down. Yep, right. The judgment cut. Does it again. He'll waste as many meters as it takes to kill a character. Now, this is pretty tough for Sentinel, but he could actually fight Virgil in some weird sense because Virgil's are single hitting moves. He could go right through them. That's true. Now, watch this. He's just going to zone him for full screen, bait him to teleport, and then standing strong. Got him! He got too slick. He got too slick. He's trying to get too slick. Yeah, I think he's trying to run up and grab him. He could have run. I mean, he, uh, Virgil has no instant overheads versus. Uh, Actually, he does. On Doom, jump light? On Doom, yeah, jump light, but he on, only when the sword is activated. Right, but he doesn't. He didn't get a combo. Right? Yeah. yeah no, so you can actually. You do jump A into a helmet break. Oh wow. Okay. And you get so, to the loop, so huh? Sentinel does have to fear that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But right. I don't think I don't think uh, Flocker knows. Right. Right. And so oh. Finally, Flocker gets the first hit with zero. Ooh, that was terrifying for Infra because we all know what happens when zero goes off. Uh oh. He's thirsty for that loop. Yes, he wants that loop. Those drones said no. Let him go. <laughs> the drones. Let him go. Oh, snap. Nice scoop. Centurion Rush. Picks him up. He's going to bring him back down. We're going to see this one more time. Oh, oh he's trying to hit him dirty. Yeah, why do you go for a counter hit setup know, right man. now? He should have ended his life. Right, that was a terrible time to go for right, getting greedy. Go. Oh, with the fake out. Oh, we're getting looped. Oh, man. Was that a fake out? I couldn't tell. That was a fake out. Yeah, he stayed in the front. All right. Oh, pick him up. This is over. Do you Here see the blink in his eyes? Like, do you not believe me? <laughs> oh, 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 Con Edison. Oh, oh. Blocker oh. doesn't mess these up. Oh, he drops to the end. That's the most crucial part, too. Okay, nice block. Oh, he comes up. Oh, he's trying to finish it off. Let's him live. Ooh. Oh, he does it anyways. Release me. Oh, he comes out level three. Oh, and he baited it with the X Factor. Oh, man, they are going at it. This it's is oh, bad. Pick him up. Right now. <laughs> on the Ooh. finish zero. All up to Virgil. Calls drones, goes for the mix up, and messes uh -oh. up. Uh -oh. oh, Sentinel incoming. This is going to be tough. And he got two meters. Right, now he has two meters. This is a totally different match. Great block. Right Let's here. see if he can do it. The oh, no, see, he don't know. Him. You can really do jumping A into helmet break, and you can get a full combo. Right, with the swords out, right? Yep, yep, yep. yep. He really doesn't know. Yeah, that's so big because now Sentinel doesn't have to worry about high low mix up. Yep. Ooh. Oh! Oh! He called it. He got it. He called I'm it. Telling he called you it. He could do it. Oh my God. Imprint up two versus Walker. Walker down. Where did this guy come from, man? Imprint played it, it, today. It got to be the hair. It's the hair. It has to be the hair. It looks like one of the Gotti brothers with the hair. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Evo 2012. This, this is crazy, man. This oh, is crazy. Even I see you guys, my man Magus. Hanging in there. My voice is hanging in there by the Yeah, we go, we go, we got this. We got this. Shout out, of course, to Team Spooky. I play when I see y'all. Yeah. Look my at, man Haunt on the board, Spooky on the boards. Yeah, the East, East West need up, man, and great things happen. I'm looking at this audience and they're psyched, man. This is beautiful, man. Beautiful. All I see is faces from this angle. Yeah, it looks weird, right? Yeah, yeah, all I see is faces. Just don't. Headless horsemen or something. <laughs> So he's going to play the same team. He's not playing the Phoenix team at all. Yeah. He hasn't played it at all, I feel like. As you can see, Flock actually switched his order so he could have the level three Virgil. He used to have Virgil second and Hawkeye third. Interesting. Man, it really seems like Flock is the type of player that is so used to dictating the match at the first character. But he's ran into this Nova and is really throwing him off. Oh, it's that protection. Yep. The drones. He got to respect the drones. And he's going to do some damage to Hawkeye right there just to scare Flocker into calling him. Oh, he's trying to go right through that buster. Right. Ooh, oh, the dome, the dome got hit. That was perfect spacing right there. Flocker didn't even see it. Ooh, 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 oh, rocket punch. Oh, the oh, infrared. Style points. Yep, style points. One I like meter. that. I give it an A+. Plus. <laughs> I give One it an A+. Plus. Ooh. Oh, I love that. He hit that medium punch just to keep him into the drone. That's the sign of somebody who knows oh how to play Oh my god, will he go to the losers? Boom! Flocker's fate is in the hands of Virgil right now. That's pretty good hands. No. 
He did not oh, get the guy canceled. You're going down, head and shoulders. Done. X Factor is going to be strong versus uh, Virgil. Oh, baited? No. Overhead. Oh, your oh. leg. Your leg. He had to push block that and he didn't do it. Get ready for this. It's a wrap. So long, sucker. He literally is telling them to so yeah. long, sucker. Losers. To the losers. Right, right to the losers. Imprint is getting hyped. Imprint, Imprint goes and advances to the winner's final. I, I can't believe this. This is like a Cinderella story. <laughs> he is guaranteed third place. You know what? It's He is just playing so good. He's playing so He's playing good Marvel out there. Real that smart. Is some good Marvel. Calculated Marvel. He got his tools. He got Sal on the back. Yep. He got the Bionic on. He got the Centurion on his Nova. He's looking good right now. And that team was, you know, kind of initially figured, not figured out, but a lot of the techniques were explored by Combo Fiend. I'm wondering, and not that team exactly, but the, the dynamic the dynamics, Spencer, yeah, yeah, to yeah, approach and rush. And Nova, yeah. Right. I'm wondering, is Combo going to stick with his Nova Spencer team? Okay, here we go. All right, so check it out. We're going to give you a little bit of a replay of what just happened. I mean, that whole match was crazy. So right now, as you can see, Mega Man got clocked in the dome. Yep, split him. Oh, he about to get he about to get that A-plus combo right now. Right. Oh, Crumple. with the crumple. Ooh, 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 let's bring it. That was very pretty. Power of the Nova Force, Grown Man Tech. That was very pretty. That was Grown Man Tech. So the two COLCC guys got to go and fight each other. I like that. And you know, they met last year, but in the losers. Right, and yeah. Combo beat them. Yep, yep, yep. So I, I got to believe, though. Okay, let's put this out there. Champ is generally considered the favorite to win this whole tournament. Yes, yes. But Combo beat kind of has a read on him. Yeah, As yep. a player. I spoke to Combo. He said he's going with a Nova against this. He is. Okay, that's smart. I don't want to see that Ricky Dink Tron stuff or uh, uh, She-Hulk. She nah, but it, it, exactly, because, you know, he's because, you know, Champ's all about locking you down, opening you up. She-Hulk doesn't really got options to she's move not around. Gonna, she's not going to do anything. Yeah, yeah, you know? exactly. So Nova. Like a Wolverine team or something, uh, you know, she'll do fine. But a zoning team, a heavy zoning team, no way. So right now, this is what Combo told me. If he loses to Champ, Champ's going to win this tournament. If he loses to champ, champ's going to win this thing. If yeah. he beats champ, he doesn't believe the champ can come out of losers and win it? No, but he combo fiend definitely, he looked at me in my eyes with confidence and said, if he wins right now, he's going to win this whole tournament. Combo fiend will Combo fiend told wow. me this. Wow. He's got himself. a lot of faith in COLCC. But the way Imprint played and the, the way Chris has been playing, and, uh, you know, there's a lot of players out there who got something to say about that. This is an interesting top eight here. Right. Most definitely. And we still got the Mexican rolling around there. Right, he's still doing with the thing, man. I'm so glad, you know, to see some Mexicans actually come in Marvel. Yeah, yeah, like, man, I actually sure. watched a lot of the videos of them. And uh, before I came here, because somebody was uh, telling me, he's like, check them out, Magus. I'm telling you, they're good. Yeah, and, yeah. Uh, they were, you know. Yeah. They were really good. They beat a lot of players. You know, the Mexican Modoc player, he beat Marlon Pipe. He beat Fnatic. He beat PR Balrog. Like, that's like a who's who right there. Go ham. Go, go ham. ham. That's, that's pretty much it. It's simple words. And I mean, a lot of it is because not people are not used to Modoc, but his Modoc would die all the time, and he would just do it with Captain America and Taskmaster. So. And so they don't respect Captain Mexico, man. They don't, man. They don't. Not at all. That character is hard too. So that team is just full Mexican, bro. You got Captain Mexico, and then you got Taskmaster, known as La Parca. La Parca. That's what we call Taskmaster nowadays, La Parca. So what are they? Are they just kind of figuring something out over there? We'll get this get match started soon. Champ is uh, doing some digging over there. Man, shout out to the stream monsters at home. I know y'all couldn't make it, but sit back and relax because this is a great show. Yeah, we'll take That's care fun, of you guys. Yeah, we're going to take care of y'all. This whole weekend has been crazy, man. Uh, you know, like you said, this game is so young, but I feel like it's growing exponentially fast. It's at that point, yep. Right. And, uh, you know, you look at somebody like Champ and Combo Fiend, neither of them are playing necessarily top-tier teams. you got to wonder if anybody besides Blocker in this tournament is actually playing what you'd consider a top-tier team. A top-tier team. team, yeah. So who knows? And maybe that's just because people haven't explored the top tiers as much, or they just don't believe in it, you know? It's Marvel 3, though. Anybody could win, especially with that glow. With that glow. <laughs> yep. You just cracked with the glow. Bruce Lee, with that Bruce, Bruce Leroy. Yep. Okay, All right. here we go. We're about to get it started. I think the buttons is checked. Yeah, look at the face of Combo Fiend right like there. He's thinking. Combo Fiend, you know that voice. He's like, I'm going to wreck this fool. <laughs> yep. Man, you already know, champ. Yeah, this, this guy's free, free, dog. This is free. This is free, dog. Yep. Oh, we got Combo? North That's free. Yeah, you know. 
So this is the classic NorCal versus SoCal. Oh, look how cute they is. Combo's like, whatever, man. Let's get it going. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. This is going to be crazy. Oh, yeah. So these two guys are teammates and they're friends. But for the next 10 minutes, they're going to be enemies. Because this is the match of the night. Ooh. Make some noise. On the right, we've got Combo Feet. Oh, yeah. yeah. The crowd likes Combo Feet. Oh, yeah. You already know we're going to hear a lot of boosts and chant. Oh, on the that. left, Filipino Jam. He's got Ooh. some boosts. Oh, the crowd is not feeling it. Hey, but for everybody who supported Champ at home and everybody who's watched this show, you know what? This tournament, this is what happens when players get to play. He's yeah. played a perfect tournament so far. He hasn't lost one round. He lost one round to Cho. He's one. lost only one round. One just round. Like I he said. just lost one round. I hit right, the we match. Go. Oh, the no, yoke. By the way, he 3 0 Cho. And yeah. here we go. Boom. Yep, combo feet already. Ooh. I feel like when Magne or when Ooh. Champ loses Magneto, it's downhill. Ooh. Oh, he's playing the Oh, Phoenix he's looking team. hungry. Ah! Got him. Ah! <laughs> combo oh, cooked. Combo looking strong right now. Oh, man, the crowd is going nuts for Combo Fiend. It's oh not looking God. good for Champ. He is so centurion. Oh, oh barely dodged that. You know what, but, but, but Champ is no slouch with these characters, most definitely. Oh yeah, he's probably the best team out there. Yeah, he's gonna take that trade, Ooh. finally put dives in. He knows he's gotta take a risk eventually. Is this gonna be the first? Ooh, the leg. Oh, oh my god, no. the overhead. Mi cabeza, mi cabeza. Ooh, eat Ooh. this. Combo be playing like a man possessed. Is this gonna be Champ's first loss of the tournament? He's gotta figure something out. Can Magneto make level three comebacks? I don't know. Oh yeah, most definitely, All most right. definitely. Oh, it's a wrap. Oh, it's done. Super. Centurion Rush. Power of the Nova Force. What a grown man. The first boss, to my knowledge, of the tournament for Filipino Oh, champ. immediately to the character selection screen. We're going to see the Dormammu. Magneto. Dormammu. <laughs> Dormammu. Dr. Doom. My voice is dying on me, man. They immediately. Ah, back there cooking with us all. That bird got her feathers plucked. Yeah, she got cooked e quick. Immediately. Look at Champ, he's rolling his eyes already, like, ah, how did that happen? Oh, please don't kill that momentum now. We need that momentum, Champ. You gotta wonder, now does he feel a little more human, like, uh-oh, I can lose. Like, this could be it. It's that theme music, that theme music is throwing him off. <laughs> he takes off the headphones. Oh, this is looking like a serious top eight. He's gotta play Dormammu. He can't mess around and play Phoenix. Why would you do that? Don't you do it. Dormammu, Dr. Yeah. Dome. There you go. <laughs> it's too happy for what's going on right now. <laughs> Nova's just ready with the elbows like, what? <laughs> what's good, Chan? <laughs> zero. This Here we go. First to three. Here we go. Champ moves forward. He said he wanted to play more defensive this whole tournament. He said he wanted to play smart, make no mistakes, and lose no rounds. He lost one already, though. Energy javelin. Yeah, he wants to put those javelins out, but he's not going to be able to disrupt those. Oh, let's oh. expose. Oh, those missiles save him, though. All right, Champ using that just to stabilize. He's got to watch out, though. I don't know how much Nova Oh, nice hit confirmed. Here we go. He's going to kill Nova, goes for the TAC. Yep. People respect his TACs because they know about the technique he uses to counter He's, you. Uh, yep, yep, yep. Oh, here he comes, the yep. man with the bionic plan. Yeah, but you know what happens when Filipino Champ has his spell stock. This could be a long match for Oh, yep. it's a wrap. Once he starts going, his Dormammu is the best Dormammu in the world, hands down. Yep, yep, that is one of the strongest Dormammu's in the business, for sure. Done. Not, if not the best. It's the best. It's the best. It's okay, the count best. it. It's the best. Oh, and the missiles, he didn't see him coming. You gotta Got respect that wood. You gotta respect yep. that wood. Well, Combo gets rid of his Dormammu. Oh. That's big. Oh, my God. Here we go. Explosion arrow. Yep, a couple of them. There we go. Now the crossover mix-up. He didn't get it, though. Not in time. Oh, that was just too slow right there. You get a level three on reaction. Really? Yeah, once they fly like that, they... Oh, clap. He can actually get another one if it connects. Oh. No. This keeps it ex extremely safe. Right. Hey, this... Oh. Ouch. Got him. This is a lot of damage building up. Oh, my God. One of the best hot guys in the business. Respect the arrow, the, the wood. Ash. Nope. Wow. This whole little sequence you found out, Yipes, it's really working. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, yeah, those arrows is sharp. Right. Oh, damn. Nice, man. Here we go, explosion. It's Yo, Clint fight. is looking clean right yeah, now. Oh, poison tip. Full screen. He needs an antidote. He needs an antidote. Wow. Oh, oh. he got it. He's getting, three. He's getting squeezed. He's yep. getting squeezed. Nice. That's, the, that's the antidote, the squeeze. Yep, nice and easy. Combo 3 looking a little disappointed right there. Yeah, but his Hawkeye played really good, and he's, yeah. doing the, he's doing that sequence you found you and really explored the ice, which you do the up shots, and then you do super. The thing is, if, you, if, you hit him, if you hit him fast enough with the Gimlet, then the chains hit, you can actually land another Gimlet. Oh, okay. So I thought you just did the lock him down. But that's guess, too, that's too. Yeah. But it has, it has its purposes, though. So he switched it up, went right back to Jenny. I don't like this. I feel like he played a great match, a great two sets. Why, why would you change it up? Really, Combo Fiend? Come on, man. This team? You got La Parker. <laughs> I mean, Spencer Taskmaster, those guys are good, but She-Hulk, I, I feel like she's too soft. She's not going to do enough. But we'll see. You know, he's, Combo Fiend's done some amazing things in his career as a fighting game player. Oh, yeah. There goes Jenny. Oh, three box to Dome. Oh, Skull. wow, that's Pick him up. Oh, crap. What's he going to do? Oh, okay. he messed it up. He, yeah, messed he it dropped up. it. Nice tag. Wow, oh. nice. Caught him mashing. Oh, oh, oh. Here we go. Yep, dead. Ready or not. Oh, oh. Done. Ah, Magneto, Magneto down here. Come on. Oh, oh, wow. wow. Gotcha. Here comes that 80K. Oh, here comes Jenny. 80K. That is a dead door mambo. Will he finish it off and keep it simple with a DNC? Oh. No, he is picking him up. He is styling on Ooh. Chance. He's trying to take his soul right now. And you already know Jenny's coming back. She wants a piece of Doom. She wants a piece of Doom. Puts it back he in. Touched the it. He touched the weed. He touched the weed. Not feeling it. Oh, I thought he was going to go for the overhead right there. A lot of people forget she has an overhead. It's very weird that she has one. Oh, that's true. He is mo uh, combo feats. Movement and awareness of the stage is so good. Yep. Oh, my God. It comes that press. Right. He does have access to X Factor. Though at this point, I don't know if it's gonna help. And now the champ is trying to find figure out a way to get 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 back in the game. Right, this is tough. I mean, you gotta start moving forward at some point. And Combo Fiend is in rare form, huh, in this tournament. He's playing phenomenal, man. Oh, oh okay, thought it was wow. a happy birthday. It almost was, guys. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh Levathe is strong. Ooh, 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 ooh. He's got level one. Yep. All right, so he needs the next hit, and relatively quickly, to make... Oh, he got nice, it. Nice, nice. He, he, go he thought he was going to go right on them. Okay, right. that was slick. He could have been throwing, too. He could have been doing either. The champ is on the road to make this three-character comeback. Can he do it? Can he block the incoming mix? up? we can see an X-Factor? Oh, in. Yeah, you can't pick him he up can't. on the back, oh, Only on forward throw, that's right. And only in corner. Here comes that Desperado music, that combo theme music. 30 seconds left. Where's the X Factor? Who's oh, the push, it? the snuff! Got an X Factor. He's got an X Factor. And there's how you beat it. You push block it. Uh, uh, uh. Nobody does it for some reason. They forget. They forget, right. Last second. Oh, oh my God. Oh, my God. Oh, oh air throw. Throw. Here comes got the punch it. in the face. He's not dead, though. Ooh! Jim has 16 seconds to make something happen. Dan -dan. That's that combo music. Oh, he went for the air throw. Oh my god, please. Oh, oh champ looking wow. real hungry, looking real vicious. Nice break there by Combo Fiend. Oh, Ooh. we got nine seconds on the clock. He's a foot dive away though. Does he have oh enough time? Oh my god, oh the leg. Vicious. Just one hit. Still not dead, champ wants that hit. He gave up, he gave up. He know what time it is, he know what time got it is. got the throw, he can go to level three, baby. Nah, he can't do it. He can't do it. It's not enough time. Ooh, with a courtesy wow. dump and a double zero. That you know what, though? I might just bet on double zero at the roulette table. That one was too After tense. that one. Ooh, 2-1 combo me looking strong. Oh, he's going back. Phoenix, man, I just don't like this Phoenix team anymore. Smart decision Why, by though? Champ. But he's he's putting himself in a position where if he does lose now, combo me, he's going to pick Nova. He's going to run it back. Right. People don't like him picking Phoenix. They know it's, it, it's, a, it's like a, a big gamble when you play her. Oh, man. Combo's like, hurry up and pick the character. Yeah. 
He's styling too hard. He just wants to win. The couple things really, I feel like he's really refocused in Marvel. Ooh, and the crowd is shouting for combo. They really want him to beat this villain. They got a couple of licks off of Dr. Doom. Yeah. Champ using that magnetic blast. Happy birthday. Oh. That one missile saved his rear end right there, man. It did, it really did. And that's why that assist is probably the best assist in the game. Oh, he's got to be so worried about that command so grab. Bad, oh, nice grab there by Champ. And here it comes. Here it comes. Yep. Let's see the TAC and how it's going to play out. Or is he going to do the trick? It's all going to happen pretty quickly. Here it is. He went for it, and he smelt it. Yeah, I think I think Champ knew that he wasn't going to kill him. And not only that, Champ's in the prime position right now to get five meters, so he's okay. Yeah, you're right. No reason to TAC or anything. He's fine. Just play it out. Got the five, we're gonna see a Dark Phoenix. Oh, try to try to grab his legs. Oh, with that phantom jumping short that Magneto has. <laughs> that is phantom. Got oh. him. Shield going down. Taskmaster coming in, losing 30%. This is tough now. This is really tough because it, it's oh, really oh. in Champ's favor. Is he gonna waste the meter? Or nah, TAC? TAC. He is definitely not. No TAC for sure. Yep. And then he gets doomed. Big, okay. what, big long combo. He'll probably TAC one more time if he has to. No, okay, it looks like he's all right. Yeah, he's going to waste it. Good smart moves. Kind of risky, it. though. Oh, that makes up is brutal. That makes up is brutal. That is, that is almost unblockable if you've never seen it before. That's like, all right, I'm going to hold back. Psych. Yeah. <laughs> Combo Fiend right now is taking some punishment. Yeah, he is, man. Champ is going to bring him all the way down. When does this combo end? Wow. Filipino oh, he's gonna squeeze. Champ. He's squeezing him. Beautiful Ooh. execution by Filipino Champ in this situation with thousands of people watching him. Oh, he's kind of rubbing it in right there. And look at him. Look, he had that look. Jaha, though. Look at Jaha though, it's like that. He's cooking. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> wow, he's cooking. Jaha. Is the he combo right now, I gotta make it. Look at that face, man. He's got that face. Like, what should I do? He should pick Nova. That's what he's gonna do. He probably has that pressure. Like, he really feels like how you told me, I, he's got that pressure where he feels yeah, like yeah, if yeah. he loses now, he loses the whole tournament. It's true, yeah. If that's what Combo said, man, if he loses now, Champ's gonna win the tournament. So let's see if that's what's gonna happen. Let's find out. This tournament's already been insane. We ain't done yet. I don't. Yeah, I don't think Champ can switch his assist, can he? Uh, no, you cannot. If you can, that's new to me. Do you know if you can change order? No, no, no. You got to keep the same order, same assist. Right. Okay, okay, here we go. He got a smile out of combo feet right there. I almost feel like it's some psychological warfare champ is playing. He's trying to get him to break that, break that, uh, you know, that that real, like, focus look yeah, he had Yeah, 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 no, that, that, that's one of champ's classics. Yeah, he does that. He tries to laugh at you and do some funny stuff to make you smile. It's really annoying if you're a player. <laughs> got it. Oh, uh oh, here we uh -oh, go. Here we go, proposition. Are we going to see a snap? Centurion rush. We're definitely seeing a snap. Oh, my God, eat this. Oh my and god, energy go. job, Aling. Oh, here comes the mix up. Here comes the mix up. Oh! oh I think he went for an air grab himself. Here comes oh, that raw tag. Oh, messed up too. Yep, there it is. And those arrows kind of saved Champ from trouble. Woo. No text right there. Oh, nice, nice hit Champ. Over. Over oh, missed it. Wow. Champ almost never misses those combos. Very rare. And here come the missiles. He's got time to play now. And they're gone, so he's got to retreat a little. But he gets punished. That was great. Wow. That was excellent. X Factor does it again. He misses. Oh my god, that was so smart by Combo, but missed it. He's gonna take the L, he's gonna lose Magneto on purpose and let Dr. Doom come in. He just needs meter. There it is. Oh my goodness. Doom comes in, he's working on that fifth bar. Is he gonna gain enough meter and snap him before he hits five? He's got the meter. Is Champ going to hit five? I think he's just going to kill a character. Wow, Here he's still going to snap. It's almost not worth it, though. I feel like that was a waste of meter. Nice block there. Oh, man. And Champ's in a prime position right now to win. He does have five meters. Yeah, he's going to keep calling Doom till he dies, basically. There it is. 
That's what he wanted. Oh, that missile is still there. Oh, and that was my God. that was best case scenario for Champ right there. Oh, he's gonna X Factor kill. Oh, he misses the combo. Good break for Combo Fiend. He's still got some life in him. There we go. Here we go. Here we go. What kind of tricks does he have? He's gonna try to run away. He's gonna he's gonna try to run away. Wow, we haven't seen this. We haven't seen this since last year. Wait a minute. Oh. oh. One down. Here we go, Hawkeye coming in. Oh my goodness. Is he gonna try to run though? Um, he does have those arrows. Oh. oh. Wow, this is very tense. Oh, oh my god. At some point he's gotta, he's just gonna try to run. He's lost the health lead. He's not gonna kill her though. Oh. Is he gonna kill her? No way, he wants the space though. He actually wants the space. Well, she's out of X-Factor though. Now, one Gimlet in some time will kill her. He's just waiting for that one. Oh! Can he land the hit? No. Oh, Champ's gotta be weary of that Gimlet though. He is in death rage. Oh, he stopped the oh Gimlet. God. I think the match is up. Yep. Filipino Champ takes it. And he's getting hype up there. Wow. Man, he played really smart. He ran the X Factor over, put her in a Gimlet range, and then he just ran into a feather. Yep. I mean, what can you do? It's Dark Phoenix. Dark Phoenix. That's what she does. She, that is what she does. She ruins Got your job life. done. Yep. Oh, yeah. She ruined mine definitely a oh. lot of times. Oh, yeah. She, <laughs> so made me, she actually made me stop playing uh, Vanilla Marvel. Oh, okay. I just stopped playing Vanilla Marvel. And then <laughs> Ultimate came in, and I was like, okay, I can all do right, it. All right, all right, all right, yeah. That character is too much. She's, well, Champ she's, she's very doable now, though. She's fine. Champ advances to the winner's finals against Infrared, and that has a lot of semi-history there. In what sense? Pretty much, uh, I was talking to Champ on Skype on the Fighting Game TV, and I was naming some players. Right, sure. So, from SoCal, because, you know, we was, we was trying to hype up the NorCal SoCal. Yeah, yeah. And, you know, I was like, I'm going to name these players that I think are good in SoCal that can run with y'all. Yeah. And the first name I said was Infinite. He said he sucks. Wow, and I think he probably said that in a less nice way that you're putting. Oh, truck. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that most definitely. <laughs> he, said, no, he said he sucked, and then I was like, damn, he sucks. Like, like that? Really? And I was like, I think he's great. I think he's good. But uh, we're going to see it. Infrit got a lot to, to, to show. Yeah. I, Champ. I think Infrit really wants to make a statement. You know, and I mean, he already has. But if he beat Filipino <laughs> Champ, that would be something else. And this route would probably go nuts for him. Most definitely, most definitely. Here we go. Here. Is it, can, can the folks at home see this bracket? Yeah, they can. So uh, like we can say, it's Root Zebra's combo team. And Chris Keeper's pocket. This is the uh, losers, right? Yeah. So, uh, oh, interesting. Fruit C versus Combo Queen. Chris G versus Flocker. Well, I mean, I see Chris G versus Flocker a lot of times. So, Chris G is in. It's a Chris G's favorite. But let's see if Flocker's gonna step it up. But didn't uh, Flocker win the last time they played at a CEO? No. He didn't. No. He didn't beat. He didn't beat Chris G. Okay. This is interesting. Zero has a hard time. Then uh, we'll, yeah, yeah, we'll yeah. see how this pans okay. out. some aqua. Yeah, I was just trying to get that. Evo 2012, once again, thanks for the folks at home for tuning in. Oh, man, yeah, it's been a wild ride. Uh, again, Magus wants you to keep on the mic here with Yipes. Yep. 90,000 Yeah, but that's not watch. enough. It's not enough, we right? We need that a hundo. Because I like to we keep it a hundo with you guys. I want you to keep it a hundo with me. Put, so put, tell it, on your your, put it on your Twitter. Tell your grandma. Hit, 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 hit the... Hit the, the uh, the smoke signal. That's right. Watch two of them. Open up another one and watch it twice. <laughs> and use that hashtag Evo2K. There is a Reddit thread, I believe. Uh, go and check that one out. Help us out, man. If we can hit 100 by 100, AE. Uh, hundo. By AE, that would be a huge, huge accomplishment for Evo. I mean, yipes, come on, man. Remember when there was like only the group people on this stage was like the amount of people with Evo, you know? Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. grown exponentially, you know? Yeah, I started to notice it when back in 05 when I started I started seeing the crowds, I was like, wow, this is gonna, this is being very serious. Yeah, it was, it it's was getting crazy. very serious. It's getting really serious, yeah. Well, if y'all if y'all just missed it, champ just sent combo being to lose. It was three two. Very good match for both players. It was very good, yeah. Uh, a lot of pressure on both the guys to win the whole tournament. I feel like at this point they feel like they could do it. The Mexican Modoc player is still in it. He will be the next match versus Combo Fiend. Now, I think Combo Fiend's going to have a pretty good idea on how to beat him. Especially if he's going to rock Nova most definitely because yeah. he got the javelin. Exactly, so. exactly. 
But this one, you know, there's uh, they played each other before. So who's more hungry? Who wants to win? That's what this one's gonna be about. Like I said, this is Chris, this is in Chris G's Chris favor, G. but you know what? Chris G. Block a switch it up. He picked that strider assist. I ain't even noticed. Oh wow, he has been playing strider assist. Wow, all right. And that is a true NorCal team right there. Oh yeah. yeah. Virgil <laughs> zero point strider. character. Virgil strider. Right? Yep, that's all it is. Okay, here we go. They calm down the soul fist, the pack pan tactics. Yeah. Oh, Big nice damage already. They off the missiles. That Strider assist is not coming to play yet. Got the hit. Uh -oh. oh, we got loop. We got loop. We got loop. The blocker, pretty famous for landing him. Oh my God, here we go. It's Con Edison. Is it easier on ooh. this side or the other side, you think? Oh, oh, I don't know, but Blocker's looking hot. Oh, he's going all the way with it. Ooh. Yep. Round two. Look at my big green eyes. That's <laughs> what he's saying when he does a loop. Look at my big green eyes. Oh, and he got out of that. He did the right thing. Uh, fly up. Oh, oh you know wow. What? He is in prime position to win game number one. More games yes. done. Yes. And here I comes the loopage. I mean, if he could basically keep him in a corner and loop him all day, that's what he would like. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh. Oh, oh he missed it. But that's fine knowing this. Yeah, exactly. I think I think Chris G tried to air grab him right there. Yeah, he gets he gets very air grabbing. Dead. Oh, my God. I got hit with an electric cross. Uh, now we can just super extract the feet. Yes, now I got to watch and think about the next strategy. Yeah, exactly. Oh. He should take his hands off the stick and start thinking. I can't. Oh, I can't play. I can't play. And Chris G <laughs> loses that one. Ask him, when do I get to play? <laughs> <laughs> and Flocka with a strong showing. That was nice. Game number man. one. That was nice. That is that's the most. Look what he said. He said, you're too slow. <laughs> <laughs> That okay, here we go. The most dejecting thing when you lose to a zero player is when you just don't get a play. Yeah. And here we go. He's dancing around the air, trying to avoid the fireballs that Morgan's throwing on the ground right there. But uh, like you said, yeah, he kind of loses this match, yep. also because he has low health. So yep. those fireballs hurt. That is true. And she has fly canceling all those fireballs. That's why she put so many on the screen. Ooh. Just fireball, fly, fireball. Oh, yeah, it's a wrap. It's a wrap. Pack it up. Uh, it's still not over though. He got virtual strider. Yeah, that's a very good pairing. Lots of hellbreakers in this future. There's one. Had an X Factor for whatever reason. Oh, oh nice and it. quick. Satan. Oh. Oh, and he misses that. Oh, wow. That's big. He dropped it. And now he's just buying time. That's all this is. He's running that X Factor. Virgil, no meter, no X Factor. Not oh. a threat. Well, that's right, assist. I mean, this doesn't even look doable. Oh, 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 oh the and stomp. Yep, working. Get an extra meter with that assist, too. Oh, oh, foot die. And level one. And he's going to THC. Is he done? He's done. This match is going to be a wrap. Strider has to hit you like eight times just to kill you. Oh, nice. Strider is an X Factor character and an assist. He is not a, a solo character. He cannot play by himself. Uh oh. We oh, getting blasted for that one. Yeah. Oh damn! That was a lot of damage. Damn, a lot of damage. Yeah. yeah. Fire, Fuego with assistance missiles. Here we go. Chris G takes game number two. And both of them kind of played into their strong suit. Like we saw when Flocker won, it was all zero. When Chris G won, it was all Morgan. That's true. Oh my God! Ooh, oh, that was it. That was it. That was it. Now he's going to have to kind of struggle. Look how patient Chris G is. He just stands there knowing he's okay. Oh my goodness gracious. There's those missiles. Puts in a little work. Eight to four meter. Gets the uh -oh. first hit. Combo. We got combos. Is he going to be able to kill zero? Ooh. Chris G. Nice. Nope. Both the TAC. He took a gamble. He really, I think the only way to kill zero would have been to do a TAC. Nice, nice, nice. You can see Flock is trying to keep the keep the ground controlled as much as possible before he goes up in the air and starts throwing the obstacle course, aka let's do the hidden temple. Yeah. <laughs> Very difficult though. I remember that show by the way. Yeah. <laughs> Shout out to Chris Bates. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, this is tough, and it's really the thing that makes this match so tough is when she's in astral vision, the fireballs come from behind. Oh yeah. And here he goes. He's trying to use still Gebu. Oh, he's going to go right in the source. Nice. Kept, okay. kept zero alive. That was a smart choice there I by Flocka. So yeah. Good defense from both these guys. Wow. Ooh. That was just some, some craziness right T there. TN Tamara. Yep. They don't play. The girls don't play. Oh. Got him. 
going for the finish. Oh, oh wow. Almost dropped almost. it there, but, but, but yeah. gained his composure. Got a little too happy. Oh, she's back. coming back. Hey, soul sister. Ooh. Fishing. Oh. He's fishing for a hell breaker. Just no kick. I don't know. It's looking tough. You're not kidding, man. This has looked like a hard one for Quaco. It's a hard one, man. Sorry. But if he gets three bars, he can make a comeback. Most definitely. He I'll, the I'll, Let's see if Quaco can do it. Wow. Oh, nice. Caught him on the flinch. Right. Done. That was so smart. The two missiles were coming. He walked up, act like he was going to throw him, tried to get him to stand up, and then went low. Oh, went for the air grab, but yep. the shell kick. Chris G is playing great. Oh, yeah, we got a Puerto Rican fight here, huh? That's right. Blocker uh, is Puerto Rican, I believe. Yeah, yeah, and Chris G. So and Chris, Chris, oh, they're both Puerto Rican. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got talents from all over the world. Well, yeah, I mean, yeah. they, 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 they from U.S. soil. But here we go. Oh, my God. This, one could be this all looks blocker. like deja vu all over again. Right. And when he gets the first hit, I feel like his chances to win the whole match are huge. They're oh a lot better. God, the Morgan is taking a hit. There we go. Oh, oh, come on with it. Nice. Come on Got with it. it. Dead Morgan. That's oh what God. he needed. Wow. Oh, Protected his dome with the lightsaber. That was a crouching B that worked as an any or somehow. Yep. Oh my God. Yeah, we go. Look Walker. at those big green eyes. Zero, once he gets you into a corner, he's one of those characters where it's, it's so hard to get out that often the match could just end after That's the first true. character is popular. As you can see, you talking about it, it's happening. Right. A lot of players, the reason they don't like Zero playing as it is because of how risky he is sometimes, and he dies in one simple combo. So he's a you know, big risk, big reward character. Okay, here we go. Kind of. It's that time to shine. Akuma, man, if you can do it with Akuma. Justin's done it. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We're going to see X-Factor pretty soon for both these guys. Somebody's going to have to take the step in X-Factor. Ooh, trying to make a push, wow, making him think it's an overhead. He dashed past the uh, push block. Should expect him ahead. Smart move. Yeah, that was a, kind of a random X-Factor. Ooh, overhead? Nope, went low. So right now, what Chris is trying to do is trying to make block and jump so he can go for the air grabs. Give him more chance for the air grabs. Right. He's motivated. x for running out the both of them, though. And that favors blocker. Oh, nice. Right for the cross. A nice block there by Chris G. Yep, no teleport mix ups right there. Stays on the ground. He knows he's got the lead. No reason to push it. Oh, trying to make a flinch, but no. Blocker doesn't crack. Not dead, though. It's going to hurt. Oh! Whips the heavy, big punish from Chris G. He can kill Virgil. He's got the meter to do it. Ooh, One super right here. You gotta respect those chunks. Like, oh, some fireball. Guys. Super. Dead Virgil. Wow, oh, and wow. just like that. One mistake. And he does not have three bars yet, so Strider. Oh, no, this is uh -oh. gonna hurt. Uh oh. But is uh -oh. it enough? Don't tell me. Magus, don't tell me. I don't know, man. I don't, I don't think it's enough. Oh, wow, he didn't even try. Would this be your t one of the top oh, 10 Evo moments? No way! Wow! Out the hunger. Blocker. The hunger of Jesus Christ. All up to Akuma, and he does it, man. Yo, he's hype. He is hype. You don't usually see him get hype. He's usually kind of like, yeah. Uh oh, he comes every play. He comes every Let's see that whole movie. Man, what a comeback. Wow, let's, let's go see that whole movie. One more time. Wow, that's all I can say is wow. <laughs> here we go. Look at this. All up to Akuma, right? Virgil Strider, so here we go. This, this is when it when it all went down. Yeah. So right because, here. And then he's supposed to do hard as hard, but he wow. did a teleport instead of uh oh he probably did the wrong trick too late. Yeah, just, no, he probably thought he came out the teleporter already. So he started oh, already doing right, that so he's exact change. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah so it's a wrap. So here you go. As you can see, this will put him in a prime position. And then he did some weird mix-ups to get the to get the hits of the air grab right there. Here. Nice, nice. Oh my god. Chris Jin G. And the fireball, then he just kind of falls on him wow. right there. Yeah. Kind of a weird mix up. He didn't expect it that time. Oh, exactly. I think he was trying to uh, air throw or something. So when he landed, he was kind of shocked that right. like, he came out of block time and just ate the overhead. Right, kind right, of a wow. sneaky mix up from uh, Chris G right there. Chris G really proven he's one of the best of East Coast. Yes, yes. So shout out to Flock, of course. He had an excellent season. Yeah, he had. He's, he's done really well. They made it to the Evo final stage, so that's a good luck. And here we go. This is the, this is a match that I want to oh, see. Oh, yeah, this is it. This I want to see this right here. Fruity versus COLCC combo feed. 
So I want to know, if Nova grabs Modoc, is he going to grab the nose? <laughs> Oh, That's well, what I want to know. That's what I want to see. I think he's gonna grab the nose. He's gonna grab the nose. I think he's gonna grab the lips. Yeah, I he's never see. Right I never lips. seen Nova scoop Moda. I don't think I. I don't know. I've ever seen them fight each other before. <clears throat> he is definitely gonna pick Nova against this character. But this this guy, Fruitsy, making an impact here. Evolution 2012. Yeah, this is uh, represented from Mexico. Right. I don't Mexico. Who would have thought, right? I don't know what TA stands for. Excuse me. My, my fellow Mexicans watching at home, I really don't know what TA stands for. Yeah, I'm sorry. I should have done some research. Yeah, yeah I should have figured it out. But I don't know either. But it's Fruitsy. We know who that is. <laughs> yeah, that's Combo. He's back that's for more. sure. And Combo Fiend. He doesn't want to go home yet, man. Not, not without winning this whole thing. Man, and Combo is no stranger to the stage, man. And all the years that I've seen him play since 05, since my first Evo, I always see this guy on the stage, whether it was CBS 2, I think Guilty Gear, I've seen him one time, I'm not too sure. Probably, man. He just, it doesn't matter what game he plays. It's just, it takes him like a week and he's already good at the game. Yeah, so. man. This guy, bro. He's just one of those players. Yeah. Combo Fiend is a living legend. He really is. The, 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 community, the fighting game community, he really is. One of those guys. Shout out to the Evo staff, though, man. They kept it real nice and clean this year. What they always do, but, you know, they kept it cleaner. It's getting year. cleaner and cleaner. Yeah, it is. I got to say sorry about my voice. I'm just oh, so we so too hyped. Don't worry yeah, about I'm it. I'm just getting so excited. That, we need uh, some agua and a back massage. <laughs> For about three days, I've been getting excited. So, you know, this is what happens. <laughs> okay, okay. But, uh, yeah, so uh, my voice is probably going in and out, and I apologize about that, but this is just too good. I think that works, huh? I think you can put it with the water. That definitely works out. Here we go, hold on. Alright, so we're gonna move with Boots. Combo. How is he gonna manage with that mode off? Yipes already talked about some of the answers he thought that were out there, which is basically using the javelin, uh, using the upshots of Gimbal. Alright, that's match. There's a lot of options. Yeah, a lot of options, definitely. Give it up. But he can't look He's gotta worry about the other guy. And his opponent for the USA. Combo wow, early with the hit. Yeah, he does not want to lose Nova. Okay, here we go, here we go. Nice one. Oh, wow, we got both of them. Oh, wow, just like that. Wow, that's a happy birthday. Gone booty with a huge lead right there. Now he's just gonna run away. There's no reason for him to rush him down or anything. He can just relax. Ooh, oh, try to get a grapple. Try to get the other. Yeah, he got the wrong grapple. He's right. And he's just gonna try to zone Spencer. They both have that track. Ooh, that was great. sick. But what can you do? Is that all you can get off it, though? I well, could have got a bionic arm there, but I think he's trying to save it. Yeah, or he just couldn't. It's weird to time it. Oh, oh nice. Uh oh, right. here we go, combo, comeback fiend. Yep, but he lands one hit. This is going to be a real match again. Nice. That was nice, really well timed. Came down with that down, down heart. Here we go, Captain America. Oh, mistimed it. It came in a little weird timing. Oh, we got him, we got him. Oh, but nice block there. Got, he got his legs clipped in the, on the crossfire. Fruity drops it though. He has dropped that combo about three times on stream. Nice and safe. And he's still sitting on X Factor. It's gonna be really hard for Combo Fiend to do anything. Combo Fiend does know both of these characters. He plays both of these characters. Right. But he can't do a random bionic arm because he's sitting there. on X Factor. Yeah, he did. Yep. Oops, he takes game number one. Okay. Pretty convincing, too. He looked good. Combo Fiend gotta be real careful how he calls his assist there. He's just hanging out at the top again. That javelin, wow, okay, so you can actually beat the javelin by shooting the eye. Oh, oh I wanted to see the yolk. Oh, the air grab. Yeah. Oh, 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 right, the kick right nice. to the head, dude. Big damage right here. He's going to go right to Bionic Maneuvers. Oh, he is so dead. No, he's I don't know left. if the zigzag works on Modoc, though, but I think he's just going to finish him in. Okay, here we go. Now, yeah. he comes back over. That last hit is, like, basically unscaled. He Except said he up. is Richie. <laughs> Nice. Oh, nice. legs got exposed. The dome got exposed. Yep. Captain Mexican is going for a ride right now. He's going to knock him down. Ooh. Crumple. And 
super. Oh, wow, he went nice, for the nice. He wasn't going to finish the ball. That's true, he only had one bar. He went for the tech setup. If he would have tech forward, that javelin would have hit him. Oh, the yolk, the Parker. Nice answer. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Bring him down. Oh, wow, nice. caught him clinching. Oh, he's definitely going to finish his play oh, right yeah, now. Crumble. Ooh, La Parker. Super. And we're going to see, no, not Bionic Arms. Does that still work? Yeah, it does. Okay. So long, sucker. He means it. He means it. Ooh, down. Here comes Nova. All up to Cap Mexico. Yeah, that theme music is playing. Let's see. Yeah, very hard to open him up with just Cap America, though. Oh, nice bait there, but he didn't get the reach. Oh, wow, standing jab, great wow. poke. Ended up working, he's an anti-air right there. That's gonna be a dead Nova. Only one bar wasted. If he can somehow open up Spencer. Oh, just got cake right there on the top of the head. Look, see how he's flexing the leopard though? Yep. <laughs> he's flexing that leopard. Ooh, one, one. Both these guys just hitting each other. Yep, there he goes. Yeah, he's trying it. Every time he goes up, first thing he does, energy gathering. Again. He's really trying to punish it, though. He's yeah. he almost baiting it, knowing oh, he's going to. He got analyzed. Yep. Here we go. Goes for the mix-up. A lot of times, players are going to debate, do I want to do damage or mix-up? Oh, man, that small shield is too strong. It's really good for Spencer and Nova, too, because we're like single-hit characters. That's true. Like oh, the yoke! Wait, oh, he grabbed his lip. Why well, he did grab his lip? It was in his mouth. Yeah, I knew he was just gonna go right in the mouth. Ooh. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, yeah, this works. Oh, okay. Whatever, it works. It's Combo marble. fiend. It's Marvel. It's Marvel. Oh, he's trying to do the straight down try but he keeps missing it. Yeah, it was a little awkward angle right there. Yeah. He's gonna pick How much is he gonna waste to kill Cap here? Probably everything. It's a wrap. Yeah, it's, it's a wrap for Cap. We didn't get that second bar, I don't think it matters. Oh, he's gonna die. Oh, long sucker. Damn, he means it. Yeah, he's gone. Ooh. Oh, he's not. Oh, Ooh. and he came. Nice. Here comes Richie. Oh, my legs. Oh, oh yeah. it's a reset. Wow. Yeah, it's he's a dead. red. Oh, great job by Cobble. Feel my power. Not enough though, you're gonna have to GAT times it. There you Ooh. go. Vince and Bonica for old times sake. Yep, <laughs> we should just call that super combo. Fit. Yeah. You know, one of the beauties about watching him play is he always sits on X Factor. Yep. Oh, here we go. Again, he gets the first hit. Uh oh. Nice. Oh, wow. Combo oh, nice block. Yeah. Great oh, block. hit him right in the head, dude. Oh, here we go. Bodok does Ooh. have very little health. Oh, damn, Centurion. Man, Man I love this character. We're going to see the, the Bionic maneuvers. So long, sucker. It, it's Richie. Yep. And here he comes. Oh, he brings him back in. All right, that works. Oh, oh wow. That would have been so disrespectful. Would have With been the push of the gut. Oh, I thought amazing. it was going to work. And the upshot misses. Wow. I, I, I would think that would work. I don't think he needed to X Factor. Yeah, he probably did the wrong arrows or a little early. Ooh, with the stiff right. Yeah, the stiff right didn't go for the overhead right there. I didn't believe in it. I think he respects Fruitsy's defense so much. He's not going for the overhead. He don't want to risk the block into the grab. It's for super. Exactly. He's punishable. People don't realize it. They always push block it, but you can throw it every time. There's the Ooh, throw. Nice, 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 nice. It's good damage. Look at that, 50%. Big gas, dash forward, negated Ooh. the push block. With the arrows. Yep. Oh! Ooh. Done. Ooh. Here comes Captain America, all up to him. All up to the Mexican hero. Yep. <laughs> he's got to do something, or he's going home. And Combo Fee will advance. Ooh. Got the assist. Combo Fee's got to watch out about calling that assist. Sometimes that's the only way to make a comeback. It's true. He's calling it anyways. I mean, Combo Fee's smart enough to know when to call him. Oh, oh sucker! That could be it. Ooh. Nice and simple. Combo Fee with the side with with the look of relief. Ooh. 
Any DHCs in the Gimlin? Yeah. Bumblebee, yeah, exactly. Very relieved. Very relieved, huh? That guy was a landmine, and he was one of those, you know, you run into him in a tournament, you'll lose nine out of ten times. He yeah, had to really yeah, pull yeah. it all together and figure it out. But you know what, Fruitsy did his thing, though. Yeah, he did. That was amazing. He got this far top eight, you know, from That's nowhere. Right. Like, you would never seen this guy before. He definitely got his medals of honor right here. He oh, got yeah. he got, him, he got, he got, got a lot it. of respect from the Marvel community from what he's done. Yeah. And now they're talking about the match right here. Kamal is one of those guys, if you ask him questions after the match, he'll always talk to you, you know. Good. You live and you learn, man. That's how you do it. That's how you do it, man. And that was sick. So I think the next match we're going to be going to is going to be... Uh, Winners finals, maybe. Right. It's going to be Champ versus Imprint. Or are we doing... Looks like Chris G's pulling out a seat. So Flocker's out of the tournament. Flocker's done. It's just these four that are yeah. left. So we got Combo Fiend, Chris G. Oh, speaking of... I just spoke about both of them. They sit down. They're sitting down and they're ready to rock. Yep. Chris G. Going to be playing that Morgan. Or is he going to play that Morgan? I don't know. We'll find out. Most definitely. Last time they met was an ECT, and Combo V came out victorious. Okay. It was three-two, I think. The Combo V won with with the pa with the very patient She-Hulk got the grab and finished the job easy. But I don't think he's. I mean, do you think he's gonna play She-Hulk this time? I don't know. I don't think he will. I don't know. I don't know. That's a good question. That didn't do anything, by the way. You know, water and uh, cold water and honey just don't mix. That's right. It looks pretty in the water. It does. <laughs> Again, sorry about my voice, but um. So right. Stream, so stream understands. They understand, man. Yeah, they do. So here we go. So oh, and Combo Fiend runs it back. What's She-Hulk? He is. Okay, so he's gonna try to go with what worked in the past. I think All he right. picks what has the most health against Chris G. That makes sense because you can take more of the more Morgan. Chip, exactly. Yeah, that's a good idea. And another reason we were talking about how Zero suffers versus her. Good combo right here. Here comes Dr. Doom. Yep, here comes Dr. Doom. Yep. Here we go. Style combo. And this is just, nice. you know, this is all meter. It's damage, obviously, but Chris G really wants it for the meter. Oh, that works. Wow, nice wow. break, too. Great tech. Range down those finger lasers. Here comes Akuma with the DAC. He's got to hold that all the way. Here she comes. The obstacle course. And just random super to DAC. He's going to hit him in the back, though. And the missiles. We'll kill some time, though, nonetheless. That's true. Oh, shell kick. Yeah, that move is really good jumping. It is, definitely. Oh, nice. Team nice Aerial play. counter. Yeah, he might have gotten uh, um, greedy there and went for the meter. Most players always uh, prevent you from gaining meter. That's what they go to. Yeah. The break. There we go. Common B with a nice tag and dispenser. And he's just gonna put out those fireballs, stop any options from Combo Fiend. He's gonna have to take a big risk to get in. Oh man, you know what? He might just he might just consider Nova. I think so. I just think it's a better option. Wow, Combo Fiend has not even touched the floor yet. Oh, yeah. there we go. Oh, couldn't really get a combo though. The missiles did in a run. Well, here's the time to make something oh. happen. Great block from Chris G right there. Got him oh. though. What uh, what happened right there? So that was a bad decision made by Combo. That was a terrible decision. He could have gotten rid of Morgan and made it a three versus two match. Instead, oh. it's a three versus two against him. And She-Hulk is not good versus Morgan. Nor is Taskmaster. So this is going to be a tough one for Combo. He's going to have to make a mirror clap and a win. Wow. Great. Nice punish. That was great in here. S. With an a S. very unsafe move, but he just knew it was going to work. Oh, interruption. Uh, this, this, this isn't a good game right here for Combo. It's about to be over. Oh, man. Chris G's just movement and knowledge of the game is just, it's crazy. Gonna grab him. Yep. Oh, command grab. Ooh. Nice. Yeah, Chris G a... has that move, you know? You know, yeah. it's actually fly cancelable, too. So if you whip it, you can go into flight mode. Are you serious? Yeah, it's so weird. Right, here we go. Oh, big Ooh. punish from Combo Team. What you got? Oh, and the oh, missiles. The interruption. Man, those missiles. They had the party crasher. <laughs> really, you know? Oh, nice. Got him. That was a nice catch there by Combo. Go ahead, girl. <laughs> Go <laughs> ahead, girl. Here comes Doom. This is looking pretty good for uh, Oh, oh that slowdown. No. I, can, I can tell the slowdown actually messed up Combo right yeah, there. Yeah, it happens. That PS3 slowdown. Uh, 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 but here we go. 
the Lavakian stop to the finish. Yeah, he's going to go all the way with that. I don't know if that was such a good idea, but... Then we're getting that raw tag into Morgan right now. Yep. Astral oh. Vision. And here we go. Call Doom and start raining the missiles. First, he puts him on top so that he can keep you on the ground. Uh-oh. Really intelligent placement. Here comes, that, here comes the aerial counter, yep. Oh, I mean, the aerial combo, excuse me. Good damage right here. Right Another back one. Into Morgan. Stole one of his meters. At the same time, yep. And here comes that obstacle course. Man, just I mean, stuck. he got a shield, but it ain't working out. It ain't doing nothing. He just stuck. You know, being combo's best entrance to tag you to keep the assist. There we go. Chris Lee, though, looking real strong. Yeah, this is it's looking uh, pretty hopeless for the for combo team. Punch in the doom about the way. Still calls it. Does not matter. Wow. And wow. Combo. Just all fireballs. 60% damage right there. And more, or Taskmaster. I mean, I've seen Combo Fiend do some amazing things with Taskmaster, but for Morgan, I don't know. Yeah, against Morgan. That is a dead duel. Yeah, the missiles and Morgan. Oh, yep. Capitalized there on the missiles. That's right. I like that. I like that. And Combo Fiend is down. Two games, Chris G right now at the verge of setting Combo Fiend straight to spectator mode. That's right, he's done if he wins. Uh, uh. So Combo Fiend has to, he has to make a decision. Is he going to go with the team that is better on paper? Or is he going to go with the team he likes? He's going to pick Nova. I think so, I think he has to. Alright, so yeah. And Combo Fiend switches to Nova, the Centurion. Right, I think this is the smart decision, guys. I mean, even if it doesn't work out, I think it's just on paper the smart decision. Ooh, with the interruption there, yep. but the missile interrupted him right back. The most brutal, cold-blooded assist in this game. It is. It's just brutal. The missiles are hidden. They are hit. You can't even hidden. punish them sometimes. That was a good punish. That was a combo. great punish. Try to go for more of a punish, couldn't he? That's fine. Doom only at like 20% health, but he gets the hit. This might be a dead Nova. Yeah, this might be a dead Nova, and he gets so much meter with that Morgan assist. Number three. He's going to get time to call Morgan and play with Doom or hard tag in a... Oh, he wouldn't hard tag, I don't think. Okay, well. Now, right now, even though it's kind of hard right now because of the obstacle course, but Chris, you got to be careful how he calls Dr. Doom because he will get punched. Right, and he'll, he'll die on one punch now. Because he only has very aware of that, as you can see. And Comfy is going to be looking. There it is. Oh. Uh-oh. Combo Fee's in trouble right now. He is definitely in trouble. They both have X-Factor. Ah, uh, guess wrong right yeah, there. Yeah, and that's going to be a dead Spencer if Christie does not drop this combo. The rest is pretty easy. You might just see it again. Yep, there it goes. Yeah. Sign exchange. And he just evened out the meters by doing all those TACs. Good block. He meant, to, he meant to do the other one. The other arrow super. Oh, the scatter oh, nice shot. punishment. Will it hit Dr. Doom? No, it won't. But oh, those hidden missiles. This is, man, they're so hidden. <laughs> they are so hidden. And, and, and Hawkeye Chris G has down. the verge right now to take this home for the yeah. East. I think so too, yikes. I think this could be it. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh! Oh, but he can't because he knew about the missiles. It's just so tough to deal with hidden missiles. Oh, oh, we got her! My sweet child of mine. Here we go. What, again? What happened? Bionic arm? Oh, he blocked. I think a bionic arm right here. Yep. And he does. Ooh. Dead Dr. Doom. Are you wait minute, serious? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, he missed it. Oh, oh no combo right What's there. What's going to happen, Magus? This is too tough. I can't call it. And here comes the Astral Vision. He oh. gets it. Combo feet pulls it out. With the clutch. Clutch, zip, and hit it in the back of the dome piece. Unbelievable. Unbelievable play. Wow. And Chris United said, like, you know, that was good stuff. That he was good stuff. As a Marvel player, he respects that. Wow. Accident. Accidental super. He's going to pay for it, too, big time. We're going to see that TEC. Now, let's see. Combo B got a guess right here. Right. This is just free. I mean, Chris G didn't even have to work for this. Oh, man. It's a wrap Nova. Yeah, that's not the start he wants. Not a good look. 
And here comes Morgan, the succubus. Yep. Trying to get under her with that shell kick is just such a good fall down move. And Morgan's gonna go back to the Astral Vision while he, uh, you know, this is Tarzan impression up top. <laughs> with the leopard. Yep. Oh, nice. Notify Dr. Doom a little bit. Oh, that was a hit confirmation there. Right, he, tried, he put him into a little 50 50 right there, but Chris G blocked it. Oh, I oh. gotta respect the miss. He went for the air grab right there. Yeah, you're right. This is just so tough. All he's doing is evading. He's never had a chance to attack. He's not gonna do much. Well, he got uh, Doom. No, he actually could have X-Factor there. Might have finished him. Maybe. Right. There could be some follow-ups that you probably do. Like, uh, jump up and then try to hit Doom when you're an X-Factor. But Right now, what combo we got to utilize after this is over, he has to use the Spritz to arrow. Goes right through the fireballs and hits right, Dr. Doom. Uh -oh. Right. The, the blue shot, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter because Chris G is looking very strong right yep. now and healthy. And this the might missiles be are so hidden. Uh, I've, I've seen him make comebacks, but I don't know if this one's even possible. Ooh. You know what? Give it up to Combo Fiend, though. He fought like a champ this whole tournament. Uh, you know, he's really stoked to get top eight. I know he's mad that he couldn't win the whole thing, but he's got to be proud of how he played. I am. You know, he played great. Yeah. But Chris G is just on point. And that Morgan missiles is its a top tier team, you know? Yeah, yeah, but Chris G advances to climb and, and still in the running to climb up that mountain and be the best. That's right. And be the best. So here oh. we go. Oh, here it comes. I know Infant wants this so bad. Yeah, I'm looking at him, man. He looks ready. He's got this look in his eyes, you know, like he's, he's ready. Like this is something he wants to win. So this is the winner's finals, folks. Win it here advances to the grand finale. Dang. And it's Filipino crazy. champ just know he knows what's on the line right now. So Chris G, Infrit, and Filipino champ. Top. That's NorCal, three. SoCal, and East, East Coast. Coast. Yep. That's wow. pretty good, man. It's pretty, it's pretty solid <laughs> top eight, though, good. man. That's pretty good. I really enjoyed the show. Yep. I mean, Combo uh, theme, one of the fan favorites, is out of the tournament. Yeah, but this is kind of what I was alluding to earlier. That's when I was saying, when are we going to see him pick, like, or when are we going to see, like, these people, these players pick real top tier teams? Because you can clearly see the difference with Chris's team versus Combo's teams. Yeah. Like, Combo's struggling to win, and Chris is just playing his team. Yeah. So. Well, we got to know about Combo. I mean, he doesn't really go to the top tiers like that. Yeah, but. In Even Marvel? Yeah. I mean, come on. I mean, he likes this team, man. Yeah. He plays a little. He plays a Marvel two style game, though. He has two front point characters and an assist. And an assist, right? That's what he does. You know, and Nova, he's up there. He's up there. He I is. give him a clean top eight. Yes, a clean top eight. Japanese team very highly up on two. Yeah. Very good character, man. Slept on two on level three X Factor also. Yeah, there's a character that slept on right there too. Deadpool. Yeah, another one. Japan's best couldn't even make it, and he is a death ball player. Right. So, yeah, the guy who won Cavalution. Yeah, really yeah. shout out to Japan watching. I know they're watching. Oh, yeah, they're watching. The whole world is watching. The whole world, man. The whole man, world is here, too, man. Day. I am going to relax once this AE comes up. But Magus, it's been a, it's been a pleasure, man. Yeah, we're going to finish this off. It's about time, too, yeah, right? Yeah, for Wait. sure, for sure. At the, in the grand stage, too, out of all on. things. Uh, on the left, Filipino champ. Infrit is and in a prime right. position to go to the grand finals. I, just, I can't believe that he's gotten this far. I mean, I, I don't mean that in like a bad way. I just yeah. mean that like he's playing so it's well. Hunger, man. Yeah, this <laughs> hunger. I always knew he was one of the hungry. Like you asked me about Infrit and his players, I'm like, those guys are starving. Yeah. Here we go. First hit, Filipino oh. champ. And Not a good try start. to hold up, right? And then got clipped in the legs. Here yeah. we go. Good combo. We're definitely going to see a TAC or the uh, anti TAC. Oh, but, nice. He knew. He knew. He's been watching the footage. Right. I think Champ is kind of disrespecting oh, the footage. Oh, the nice. dome. Let's see if he takes a page out of Combo Feet's book. Snapback. Yep. Wow. Oh. Nice. Nice. Ooh. Wow. Great. Nice. Let's bring it. Imprint is playing phenomenal right now. His game plan is working out. Oh, the cross-up! The champ was not ready for the cross-up. That was so sick. Ooh! Crumpled. Do you see the pain in the character's eyes when they get hit with that move? And it just looks painful. Oh, it snaps in Magneto. To should have just killed I know, but he's also in, probably in his head trying to prevent the X-Factor level 3, so. I see, I see, I see. Nice uh -oh. tag. But you're right, I would have killed Doom too. Should have just killed him, finished his plate. I think he was just killing himself too much right there. 
from the Tempest. Try to avoid the dirty snow. That didn't work right. out. Oh, the two missiles. Wow. Those See, man, he would have killed Goon and had, had nothing to worry about. But You're right. It was a bad decision there. It was a bad decision. Two missiles are too powerful. Oh. He doesn't get opened up. Oh, went low. Got him. Chipped him out. All up to Sentinel. This is not good, man. What happened? I feel like it was such a good match. Oh, he just pancaked Dr. Doom right there, but he got out alive. Oh! oh trying to get greedy and press a button. Yep, and Crouching, uh, crouching B ended up eating whatever that was. It's still anybody's game. That's true. Infant right now, just so you can keep it safe. Yep, one Should foot abuse dive. the Roundhouse Sentinel bomb. Oh, oh, hit him with the foot, hit confirmation. Nice, nice. by Infant. Man, you love those bombs, huh? The bombs, gotta drop them. You gotta drop the bombs. Gotta drop the bombs. Oh, Champ, look at Champ him. Champ is disappointed in himself he's right there. He's closing his eyes and thinking. Oh, look at that boy. He's going, he's going ham right now. And look at Infant. He looks focused. He's like, don't touch my hair. Yep. So that's all he asked for. He'll play, he'll lose, he'll win. Just don't touch my hair. I think he, I think he kind of respects Infant now. He might want to take back what he said earlier. Oh. oh. Champ, very rare, dropping his combo. Very rare drop. And he's going to get smacked hard Ooh. for it. He's gonna kill him. He's ending him. Yep. That's crazy about that move. You got all the time in the world. That's so crazy. To make that decision. Here comes Nova. Run it back. Oh, he's keeping Spencer. Oh, nice. That was a good block from Filthy and Champ. Wow. wow. Infrit is so on point right he's, now. He's not playing no games right he now. He's not playing around. He's trying to win the cheese. Got him. Ooh. And. Yep. Nice. Snaps her in. She's still got only four bars. Wow, smart by Imprint, but he didn't fall for it. Our tag. Got the foot dive. Wow, here comes five meter. Yep. He's going to get it. This is going to be a hard match now. I wonder if Imprint has some anti Phoenix technology he's going to be showcasing. I mean, if he has it, now's the time. And now is the time, most <laughs> definitely. Nice. Wow, clocked him right in the head. Oh, nice. Man, that, that by Champ. Champ's his defense, that's really what is the best thing about him as a player. God, couldn't land it. Oh, he stopped her. All right, couldn't set up much right there. He's going to have to deal with it. Oh, wow. 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 He gets it. Imprint showing no emotion. He's Wait. not, he's not, he no, he can't party yet. Not till he wins. It's true. Look at him. No it's emotion. It's true. He might go for the character select. I don't know. Domamu? He just might. And look at Jaha still. He's still this. cooking, man. Still cooking. <laughs> well, what that that looks like the momentum has been shot the Filipino champ. Wow. He is going to go to the Domamu. He might just take his time to breathe right here. Oh, he's going back to Phoenix. Magneto, Dr. Doom, Phoenix. Let's see if he can come back. I am so shocked. I mean, who Look at this thought? man. He's like, just don't touch my hair. Yeah. That's it. Just don't touch my hair. Very shiny. Looks good. Yeah, just don't touch my hair. Yeah. That's all it is. <laughs> he got his trunks on right now. <laughs> LXG. Legion of Extraordinary Gamers. Imprint versus COL. He goes, of course, he's going for that TNC. No doubt. He might go for the tech. There's another way. If you think they're going to be mashing TAC, he has a setup that'll restart the combo, but he goes for the TAC instead. Right. And when you do land those TAC combos, you're seeing the other character fly in. All the hit stun deterioration is gone. Goes. That's why you see these long combos after it. You got Max Meter had to spend one just to kill Nova. Not a bad decision. Right. And the mix up. If we're escaping the mix up, no, he does not. Oh, he did. He had a punish Ooh, right there. Grabs. Almost all characters' S's are punishable. He did not punish Magneto's right there. That bread and butter, the classic, the right. efficient combo. This is, uh, you know, the fighting game TV combo right here. There it is. That's what I was talking about. He went for it. Two TACs later, then he finally goes for it. Oh, but he gets hit. Both these guys dropping combos. Oh, nice B. I don't know. Uh, that's fine, I guess. Big mistake. Oh, missed it. Infant getting a little nervous, perhaps? Probably. Spencer, dead. We're not even going to see Phoenix. I think Champ is just going to OCB him. He's ending him right now. That's not good. Not good for Infant, at least. And we're just going to see a level three on the ground. Nice and easy. 
fool. I actually thought he was going to hop out. Okay. <laughs> Champ trying to get back in the groove of things. Yeah, he's, he's, something went wrong the other two games. He played better that time. Maybe Infant played worse. I don't know. We'll see. He's really thinking, though. Yeah, he doesn't want to drop this, man. He is in a prime position. He knows it. He does, right? Like, this is his chance to win Evolution. So this is how it go down. If, if Champ wins right now, Infant might just lose to Chris G. Not trying to down him, but I have not seen him fight a good morning. I've never seen. I don't even think they have any in SoCal, so... Yeah, and then uh, and if Infrit wins, it's a 50-50 from there. Yes, I'm I agree, I I'm agree. Then it's like good matches all around. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so if so you're a go. fan of, uh, you know, good matches, you might want Infrit to win. But uh, otherwise, yeah, who knows? It's true. Because remember, Champ had Chris G done for a moment, but then Chris G actually found an answer. Yeah, he did. That there. was crazy. Came back and really picked apart for you know, Champ. All right, so good early zoning for Filipino champ. He's gonna play a little more zoning till the missiles come down, then watch him move in. Oh, Realized he one. couldn't get anything done, he's gonna go back to zoning and missiles. Very methodical in the way he plays. Here they come, a little bit of rush down. But Infrid is countering that by filling the screen up with drones. Oh, hit him. Mr. Hickam for oh. a moment with the wall launch. Good anti-air. Gets the TAC, all right, a little stop from champ, why not? Now, I, there's no reason for him to do that. And he got four meters quick fast. Yeah, it was fast, but he could have had five if he just went the old school way. Yeah, that's true. Air grab. Oh, wow, standing jab. And he got in for the little jumpy. Yep. That's why Champ is so good, too. He sees those things. Well, I would have went for air grab. He does standing jab and gets real damage. Nice. Nice break, finally. Ooh, good defense from Champ. Got out of there with some up back. Just for hit confirmation there. And Spencer's going to go down. Well, and if he breaks the TAC. And yeah, here we go. No Does not. He's going to die. Takes away a meter two at the same time. Yep. It's a complete guess. There's no way to tell which one he's going to do. Oh, man. Again, are we going to see another OCD from Filipino Champ? Has he really figured out Infinite at this point? Yeah, yeah. Oh! Wow! They're doing the wall on him. He went a little too long. <laughs> he went a little too long. That was, that was cool though. That was homage to MVC2 right there. Ooh. Still not dead. Let's see. I, I, I am very curious on what Infrid is thinking right now. I have no clue. He just wants to get in and hit him. But how? I mean, what can you do at this point, right? That is whack bots. Yeah. He has X Factor. X Factor hard drive? That's not it. Body armor moves. I mean, we'll see. He has to go to the Dr. Doom first. Yeah. Champ's playing patient, too. He's not He's not giving him any chances. That jump fierce does chip damage. Got him. That's it. Two, two. Filipino champ went two straight after the initial two wins from Infrit. Huh? Big sway and momentum. Right, here we go. This is crunch time. Somebody's going to sit at the top. This is it, man. Just this, like Dr. Doom right now. I feel like this, like you said, in some sense, Infant might be thinking the same thing. This is it for me because if I lose this, I'm going to fight some unknown stuff I've never seen before. Yep. This, this is pretty crazy. That is most definitely what is going in Infant's mind right now. But knowing Infant, you know, that guy really is analytical about the way he plays. He analyzes a lot. So maybe he's gone in there and thought up some ways to beat Morgan. We'll see. But it ain't over. You don't have to fight Chris G yet. So oh, Infant, just look at the very different expressions. The very, very different type of people they are. Champ, very emotional, very expressive in the way he looks. And man, Infant just don't touch my hair. Infant is all game. He's all game, man. Here we, Here we go. go. Winner here it's advances exciting. to the grand finale. Grand finals. Infant with the first day. You know what that means. We're uh -oh. going to see a snap. Here we go. What is he doing? He, like, debated right there. You know what? I respect this decision. This is actually a good decision right here. You think so? He yeah. I feel like he should have snapped. But that is Magneto's. That is one of Chance's strongest characters, which is Magneto. All right. Maybe that's what he was thinking about when he was sitting there. Like, if I hit him, I'm going to kill Magneto. He's getting the meter. Wow. He is getting the meter. He can TAC down for free if he, if he has any TAC combos. Champ doesn't break him. Uh -oh. There we go. Oh, wow. 
Oh my god. Here comes the raw tag yeah, immediately. He's baiting it. He sat there and waited, but he couldn't get anything. Drones helped him. Another snap. Champ has to defend again. Great block. But here's the hit. Wow. It's all over. Phoenix is gone. Dr. Doom coming in for some full team. Wow, there's, this is pretty hopeless. Right now, Imp is playing the very patient right now. The drones, the javelins. Yeah. Wow, Infrid is amazing right now, is, man. With proper, proper, proper decision making. He's playing incredible, yeah. He's like, I, I, I've never seen him play like this at, you know, the run back or anything. He's playing Oh, really nice amazing. slide right under the foot that Man, he is in full control of this match. Oh, man. And Infrid wow. advances to the grand finale. Man, this guy deserves it too. He's been working his butt off. Wow. Wow, and champ. He's trying to shake it off, but I know, I know he's damaged in this his head. This goes right one now. of your finalists. Oh man, LXG Infrit. Uh, amazing. I mean, I still, I'm, I'm in shock that this happened. What? <laughs> Infrit, man, like Infrit's in grand finals. Oh I, my God, a chance not feeling it right now. All right, so, uh, oh, we got a replay here that we're gonna go to. Oh, man. And you can kind of look at what happened. He Got tried to hit him with the S right there. Yeah. Got hit with the standing jab into the combo. Man, that's That brutal. was a smart decision to kill Magneto. Yeah, I really think you're right. I think that killing his best character made more sense than just wasting all the resources killing Phoenix. Yeah, and you know, so. and, and, and Chance not even close to getting to five meters. Yeah. Wow, that was an excellent decision by, by yeah, there's Your boy, a, LXG and Frit. There's a, there's a lot of theories of just trying to steamroll through a team as opposed to just trying to go directly to Phoenix. Right. Like, if you just kill the team quickly, you'll get to Phoenix and she'll only have three bars, so. But he kind of mixed it all together and really just played perfectly. That was good stuff. Yeah. Nova was definitely the star of the show in this one. Man, yeah. This Nova is so good. He has so many tricks that it's hard to defend versus him. Wow. <laughs> I am very proud of this guy, man. Yeah, he's played good. He is playing very solid right now. It's good to see, too, because, you know, I talk to this guy on, uh, on like, all the social media sites a lot. And he's just, like, you know, we're always talking, like, about he just wants to play people. He wants events. He wants to go with places, you know. And uh, he That's seems like a really genuine guy. Yeah, man, he's real cool. Not you cocky know? at all. Right. Right. That's right. Yeah, there's uh, another point that I'm getting uh, told on the uh, – the voice of God through the mic here is that uh, <laughs> he was the only guy when uh, me and Hans and a couple other guys put together the NorCal Knockouts uh, tournament thing. It's kind of similar to uh, the Curly Mustache. Right, right. But uh, he was the only guy who like really came up to us and was like, hey, is it cool if I like try to get on there? And like, you know, it's just little things like that show to me that he really wants to be the best. Hey, yeah, man. That boy has been grinding. Oh, shout outs to Broken. So you already know I like their stuff. Oh, yeah, I've heard of them, Yipes. Yeah, I've heard of them guys. Those yeah. guys kind of helped me out, you know, travel to these events. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So we're going to see some new stuff in the future from you. And, and oh, yes, too. definitely. Right. I can't definitely. wait, man. So keep us, keep us updated on that. But there's a promo, right? So, yep, yep, uh, yep, yep. What is that? Take 10% off uh, of everything right everything, now. Right? So there's no, you don't even have to do anything. It's just 10% off. 10% off. Just go to that website right there www.brokentier.com. Huh. Yeah, no promos, nothing, man. Just 10% off. How about that? 10% off. Just yeah. thank you for supporting our team. You know, supporting me, Clog, Viscon, Dominion. Dominion, who's Coogie. still... Coogie! Man, speaking of Dominion, dude. Oh, yeah, he's next up. He's next up. This ain't next done, up. right? This ain't done. It's I know Marvel's done. hype, and uh, we're losing our voices, but there's two more commentators coming up after us, and there's still AE. Oh, yeah, that's going to be a show, man. That's going to be amazing. I, I really can't believe the Di return how Dominion... Of Di the return of Daigo. The return of Daigo, Dominion, fighting... As an American champ, oh yeah, Pierre Balrog, wow. still oh, in there, oh, playing yeah. phenomenal in winners, I believe. He's a winner, yeah. So yeah. Th those are my favorites right now. I am going, I am rooting for Dominion and I'm rooting for PR. Those are my. I am too, favorites. absolutely. I'm yeah. also kind of rooting for Daigo. Yeah, Daigo, man. You know, he seems very hungry. At the CEO, he took a he took a devastating blow to this game for it. I feel like he's he's playing different. Yeah, know? he's playing different. He's playing that, to have more fun. Yeah. Be exciting. You know, I he like that. He has that will to win, man. Yeah. That's, that's Daiko for you. He's the best, man. You know, one of the greatest Street Fighter players of all time, so. 
Definitely. And we got Godlike Control Premium Arcade Stick Parts. Wow, introducing the Spark CE, the world's only adjustable optical joystick for Sanwa. Wow. Nice. GLS, silent and precise. So, so what? It doesn't make no like right. noise? You, you don't hear a lot of clicks and oh, stuff like okay. that right, when right, you do right. it. Oh, that's so. sweet. Right. So if you're playing footsies next to a guy, he's not going to hear you, you know, click, 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 click. Oh, around. sweet. Okay. Okay, I get it now. I get it now. Okay. That is that is actually a smart investment, actually. Yep. For those players. You know, if you play a lot of those OG players, wink, wink. Oh, yeah. Definitely. And uh, here's, uh, yeah, Kaneda, who's, uh, you know, from the Bay. Uh, helps me out a lot with uh, getting to and running uh, TNT. Oh, yeah? Yeah, so you can check that one at SRK Live, which is what he runs as well. Um, but this is his shirts that he actually has now all the uh, original World Warrior characters he has shirts for. So whichever one you want, you can go ahead and check them out. That looks sick, though. Hyper Collection. That's pretty cool. Right. They all look sick, man. He did a really good job, you know, putting them out. But the code right there, um, Evo, if you type that, you get 25% off all of uh, the SRK tees. So, yeah, check that out. Store.canada.com. Yeah, that's us. This is a show, man. Oh. I am enjoying myself, man. Oh, yeah, man. This is my seventh Evo. Can't yeah. stress it enough, man. I cannot miss it. I think the only one I missed was OA. I hey, did, too. Yeah, that, that was, was the one the I really missed. That was the only one I missed. This is my seventh Evo as well. And that was yeah. a serious one. Choi won two championships. Oh, wait, that, yeah. no. It was 07 that I missed. Oh, I'm you sorry. missed yeah, it. Yeah, uh -huh. it was 07. I was at 08. Yeah, Choi won two. I was I was getting really excited. That, that was so serious. That yeah. actually brought a tear to my eye, man. No lie, because I saw how happy he was. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, uh, yeah, my boy, he was just sitting here, you know, uh, we've been through so the much. The voice of God. Yeah, and we've been through a lot, and uh, it's good to see him doing an event like this now, which is Haunts, and uh, you can follow him in the, the site that he runs, which is a dope site. I Play Winner. Which is at I Play Winner, right. Uh, uh, and my boy, Team Spooky, of yep. course, on the boards, you can follow him at Team, Team Spooky. Spooky. Yeah, there you go. Pretty yeah. much. <laughs> He, and he That's does my the, boy. <laughs> the big two. He also helps you run Curly Mustache and and That is my road. That is my road dog. Most definitely. Yeah. <laughs> he comes up. Curly Mustache. I got a couple of more surprises for that. Oh really? So I'm we're not, not done yet. I'm not. I'm not done yet. But uh, just know it might not be. Uh, I don't want to say that. Don't say it, man. Don't tease. I don't want to say that. Come on. I, don't don't, say that. I mean, don't tease us unless you know for sure. So. But just know we have three Curly Mustache champions. That of, of course is Noel Brown. Yes. Marlon, Marlon Pye, Pye, the two-time. Yes. Curly Mustache champion, and of course Filipino champ just won it not too long ago. Yes. Yeah. This and I love this. I honestly feel like Curly Mustache is what set the standard for the tournament. For the three out of five. Yes, man. and everybody. I could take me for that. Him. And uh, even NorCal, we were like, yo, Curly Mustache is too sick. We tried NorCal knockouts. I know we're going to do saw, that I saw. in the future. Did right? GC Yoshi win there? Yes, he yeah, did. Yeah, yeah, I saw that one. I saw that one. And, uh, you know, he didn't do so good today, but uh, he hasn't traveled to a lot of majors for this game yet. But he's he'll get sick, better. dude. He's one of my better. favorite players to yeah. watch. Because oh, yeah, I'm a big Chris Redfield fan. Yeah. Because I love Resident Evil. I actually was playing uh, Chris Redfield, Dante Storm. When the game was out, like yeah. one of my Chris teams, but right, my I first, really exactly my first team was uh, Chris uh, Deadpool Dante. Oh, okay. But, uh, yeah, yeah, we think alike, man. Yeah, exactly, Chris is just too hard, man. It's too hard. Yeah, I like to the, move around, you know. The way Yoshi makes it work, man. That neck breaker. Yeah. OTT, throw the grenade, 100%. Call Spencer, yeah. yeah, that one is dirty. It's pretty cool. Yeah, but uh, so I look forward. I really look forward to Curly Mustaches. I haven't missed watching one yet. I watch all spooky streams too. I don't think I have missed a big two in forever, man. So yeah. I watch them all whenever I can, at least. But. Uh, Yeah, I mean, uh, as we talked about earlier, um, AE is, is going to be next, and it's a truly an international. You know, like, Marvel, it's great. It's a, it's an awesome game, but there's a lot of people out there from other countries who may not identify with some of the players. They, don't, they could care less who Filipino champ is. Exactly. But, but it, you know, you're watching AE. It's truly an international competition. There, there's got more, players got Korea. from all over the world. That's right. You got Japan. You got Korea. You got uh, China. You have uh, the U.S., Puerto Rico. Taiwan. Yeah. Taiwan, yep. Uh, and it's just, oh, uh, sorry, uh, Human Bomb from Hong Kong, but I think he also um, practiced in Australia. Yeah, that's what I heard him from, with Toxie and I, right? Exactly, yeah, that's yeah. what I heard him from. But he's representing Hong Kong, which is just, it's incredible when you look at that, you know, all these players, and they're all basically. So just to give you all a heads up, in the yeah. winner's side, in Street Fighter AE, it's going to be Daigo versus Infiltration. That's going to be a huge one right there. I think the winner of that one may have a chance to win the whole thing. The whole thing, yeah. And then you got PR Balrog versus Human Bomb. I like PR Balrog. Yeah, yeah so, so do I. Then on the loser side, we got Punko, of course, one of the fan yeah. favorites, versus Shao Hai. Shao Hai, huh? And he's been pretty much doing a lot of work. I remember when I was uh, in Justice Creed, I was like, yo, man, this guy's sick. 
Shao Hai, and I was like, yeah, I've never heard of him before. And then I actually saw him play in the top 32. He's really solid. Right, he did go to Shadow Luke Showdown, did some damage over there, too. I, got, I got to think Punko's the favorite now. Yeah. Huh? And you know what? I heard Shanghai plays a lot of different characters, so he might play a counter game okay. playing Poco. Oh, that would be interesting to see. Then you got my my boy, yes. Broken to his own Dominion, taking on Gamer, Gamer B. B. He got the hardest matchup in his uh, out of the three guys he could have faced, I feel like. Yeah, actually. But um, he, I talked to him, you know, um, in the elevator, and he was saying, I'm ready, and I got some stuff for... Uh, for uh, eight on, and you know, you talk about bad matches, and he's like, "What isn't a bad match for Guile?" And yeah, I'm like, true, right. man. Good point, man. <laughs> There's so <laughs> many bad matches for Guile. It's, it's a tough world out there for him, man. But you know what? He has one of the most solid defenses in the Street Fighter business oh, right for now. Sure. So, and his reactions are amazing. Like he's just, uh, he's he's always two steps ahead. I feel like when he plays, so it's gonna be fun to see. Uh, I'm not sure what they're doing. Uh, of course, we're just uh, killing some time before we get to, you know, the last two matches. Yeah, and it's about to go down right now. Both players are setting up their controllers. Yeah. They, they arcade sticks. They weapons of choice. And it's going to be Chris G versus Filipino champ. In a loser's finals. Loser's finals. Right. So we are at your top three right now. Right. And I think I said earlier, but just to reiterate, it's three out of five the whole way. We're not going to pull out a seven or anything crazy like that. So these guys are going to play. The winner is going to play in for it. And then if they defeat Infant, they're gonna have that resets the bracket, Ultimate and then they have to win another three out of five set yep. to win the evolution. That is correct. Yep. And this Man, is to be Infant the champion. Infant grand finals. Yeah. Well, nobody expected that. Nobody you know, expected. That. I mean, obviously everyone knew he was a hungry, talented player, but no one expected Infant to be sitting on the top right now and with a chance to win I think the Infant, world championship. I think Infant was the only guy who expected that. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Man, right, and right. SoCal's pretty high. Remember, this is right here, right now. As you can see, this is sparking. I mean, the SoCal NorCal yeah. rivalry has been it's in the mix forever. forever yeah. But now for Marvel, this is really setting the tone for the NorCal versus SoCal. Yeah, it really is, man. And yeah, I need, uh, a, I need to set an event, man. We will settle that. Yeah, I really got to do that. Definitely. Everybody be on the lookout because that will be set once and more. And there goes Christian G, East Coast final hope. The East, Last yeah, that's right. And he's gonna go with Morgan, Virgil. I don't he's not. Um, Speaking uh, of Mamo, he has no, he has no chance with Phoenix against Chris G. He has been proven. Because of Hawkeye, wasn't yeah. it? No, it was just it's more Morgan. Because he has combos that takes meter away from you. Oh right. So, so if he lands in the, in the in the obstacle course, he has a combo that takes away the meter. Yes. So well, he always I meant, has a I meant this team that Champ's playing right now wasn't the reason he struggled so much when they played last. Right, right, because right, of, right, of Hawkeye. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. Okay. And here we go. He starts throwing Mambo. He starts throwing Mambo because he knows if he runs into Hawkeye at the end, he's gonna get beat up. So smart decision. Yeah, smart decision. He's got the, he's, he's stocked up. So here we oh go. Oh my God, we got a we got a misses of hidden match. Yep. This could be two hidden misses. This could be a nightmare for both players. Nice tag. Wow, he just hard tags into it, which is We might just see a hard tag right to Magneto. We might, oh, there he goes. He does, wow, yeah, he called that one. This is a counter fight. It really is, it's like Street Fighter 4, you know, you pick your character before the match starts, and this one, they're just raw tagging to the characters to counter pick. Here we go, first hit. That's the problem with Hawkeye. He has a strong ground game, but when he, when he has to has to hit the SOS. That floaty jump really kills him. Yeah, he has no panic buttons either. Like when he's defending, he just has to defend. There we, we go. go. Stocks him up. The stockpile. And he's gonna put out a stocking flare for sure. Pretty soon. And here we go. Yeah, right in the chaotic plane. That's big damage to Doom. Oh, wow, he had the meters? Wow, he went all I the way to, to level three. And, and here comes Dormammu. Morgan. She is not a great solo character, though, I feel like. And Domamu against specialist? Yeah, Domamu, really. He's not going to let her do anything. Oh, but Chris G, if he gets first hits like this, is that going to hit? Yes. Okay, wow. so dead Magneto. And Domamu is going to come in and have to defend. But what is he going to do? That's a lot of time burned right there. And he has X-Factor, too. Yeah, that's true. He does have X-Factor as well. He has to defend all this and not lose Dormammu. It's, oh, oh, it was so important that he didn't lose Dormammu. And, he and did there it goes. Lose. Now it's an even fight. It's a real fight, yep. Oh, Ooh, ouch. Oh, man. He ouch. I feel like he could have killed him if that kept going. Very patient. I don't know how he's going to make this work with Dr. Doom, but we'll see. Yeah, lots of chip damage, I'm assuming. Oh, what? Will it catch him too? Yeah, good chip damage. Puts out some missiles. Jump. Oh, I think he's gonna jump hard. A lot of people try to jump out of the missile, so you jump hard to keep him on the ground. He's just gonna oh, he's chip him chip. out. He's getting chipped. He 
Can't do anything about it. He's gonna have to do a random uh, super or something. But he is at that angle. He was just ducking and sitting at that angle where they weren't hitting him. There we go. He got him that last, that last. That, last one. that one chips as well, so it could have been either. M, uh, M chips? It does, yeah. Well, I know that. Well, I don't know. Well, I never noticed his eyes was red in the red hoodie. Oh, okay. Well, something I mean, every day. I, maybe it's that alt. I don't think it's always like that. Or that color. Yeah. Maybe it is. I don't know. All right, so he starts Hawkeye in anticipation of his Dormammu on point. And look how the lockdown starts already. This is such a bad match for Dormammu. Here comes that roll tag. I smell it. Yeah, I, I think he's going to do meteors. There there. Oh, wow, that was sneaky. Got him. And here, let's see what he does. Is he going to be TAC or is he going to try and fish for something? Oh, super. He's just going to kill Hawkeye the easy way. Very smart, I feel like. Ooh, great, great job, champ. What a quick finish. And he is stockpiled and ready to go. Oh. But got kicked right in the Cabeza de Fuego, but no hit confirmation there by Chris G. Oh man, another safe tag. I don't know why he wants to play Doofers Doom for whatever reason, sacrificing the fact that he had hit missiles in the back. That's true. Well, that is weird, huh? Yeah, I, just, another... I don't know why he would do that. Maybe he meant to switch to Magneto, but he's just kind of nervous and held the wrong button. Oh, here comes that roll tight of Dom Mom. Good lockdown from Chris G right here. Act Astral Vision is activated, so he's going to get the two rows of fireballs. And Chris G, man, one of the hungriest players in the business right now. He's just so good, man. He never gives up. That was a nice punish. I like that. That was sick. Didn't do a lot of damage, though. They didn't interact very well, the two supers. True. But I think he went for the shock with a punish uh, Dr. Doom. Oh, right. Uh, yeah. Oh, that one, that's a little damage right there to Dr. Doom as well. They're both trying to kill each other's Dr. Dooms in the back right now. Uh -huh. Right now, Champ is taking his time right now. Dr. Doom can heal just a little bit. Yep. That, oh, very lucky. Missiles are hidden. They are just too good. Champ just playing really good, really solid. Nothing fancy, just running away. Oh, wow, that was a big mistake there by Chris D. He actually lost the meter because of that. Yeah. Oh, he's dropping all these strange combos and doing uh, stuff he's not meaning to. Chris G might be getting those jitters. He may right. be choking right before our eyes. Right now, what, what Champ is doing is he's, he's going to take the chip so he can get the second meter. Right, that's very important so he can DAC in the Stalker player. And, right now, and I like that from Chris G. So it, just, to test, just to test the raw tag, he, he, he noticed it himself. Yeah, he yeah. noticed it too. He didn't want him to gain that meter for free. Oh, and hit missile, save him again, but that could have been it. Oh, oh opened up. Good blocking from Champ, though. His Doom Probably Assist is gone. It's going to be very hard for Dormammu. Got Doom, so they both killed each other's Doom. It's an honest match right here. Yeah, X-Factor's gone. Match. Oh, anti-air S, and he ran right into it. This is going to be terrorizing Morgan's, those pillars and black holes. Wow, because she could have opened him up right there. For the raw tag right there. Astral Vision. Champ's gonna fly away, power up, and back out. Astral Vision without Doom is oh. not nearly as scary, but he got some hits. That's not gonna work. Oh. Yep. That's not gonna got work. The bounce. Yep. Chris G takes Chris game number G two. Takes dramatic fashion right there. I have no idea why Champ didn't think that was going. I think if anything, he's like, maybe I could just kill her and I won't and it won't matter if I get hit. Yeah, that's true. Now we go start it. Here comes that counter fest. Yeah, and that's gonna be the dynamic of this match. Oh, pick up, continues the combo. Nice, broke it. Damn, seen the comments. Oh, right. nice gimlet. Yep. And no DAC. Well, here comes the DAC. He's gonna stock up some powers. Or not. Just trying to chip Hawkeye. Oh, went for the dark matter teleport mix up. It looks like he might be going for Dark Matter mix up more because he really wants to get in and Ooh, do damage. Got him right in the face. Yeah, that was nice. Again, good reaction, but he teleported. Oh, no, it hit him out of the teleport. Wow. I don't know what this is. He's in a dangerous position right now because Hawkeye is no joke and X-Factor. Aims for Doom right there. Can he kill him? Nope. That was a bad decision by Chip. I don't know why he went for that. Very messy match. You can sense the hunger in this match, though. Yeah. Because they're just doing these things that they feel are going to work. Oh, nice air throw there. That's yep. the Chris G special, the air throws. One of the best air throws in Marvel. I think he should. Oh, there we go. That was just about to say that. Ah. He, he heard me. He heard he my brain. He heard you, man. He's in there. Spirit of Yikes is guiding him. 
is going to activate Astral Vision. This is going to be so tough for Filipino Champ. Dr. Doom has no answers for Astral Vision. Oh man, Chris G is looking solid right He's now. He's looking very solid. His game plan is working. He picked Hawkeye. It really was the answer the last time they fought. It seems to be the answer this time too. Here we go. Look at the chip damage too. Magneto's health is dwindling away. He's got to stabilize the match a little here. He wants to breathe. Now this is going to be a problem. Oh! oh clapped him in the back of the cabeza de fuego. Yup, knocked him out of the stalker player too. Champ just gets no time to think. But the Doom is going to help him out. Okay, nice, nice decision there. Right. I think he's trying, he's trying to clip. Oh, wow, nice tag. Oh, oh big punish. I don't know how I feel about that. We're going to get another. We're going to get. Oh, wow. Oh, oh nice. Ooh, what? They missed. It would look like it would work, though. It's right. I mean, he never misses a shot, right? <laughs> this is very Got nice. him. Yep. That was an excellent punish there by Chris G. Joe Marble coming in pretty hopeless. Wow, nice. He needs a random super. It opened up. TNC, nice, and he's yeah. finishing it over the TC. And the rest is just a random tip. Chris G up to the Filipino champion one. Wow. It ain't over though. Is Chris G going to be the champion? You tell me, Max. I, I still like Filipino champion. He's just got to figure out how to beat this team. I feel like he's. When he wins, it's, it's like, wow, yeah, exactly. That's Filipino champ. But when Chris G starts working and starts getting the more doom going. I don't the, think the, anybody the, can really beat that. The you defensive know? momentum. Right. It's not really champ or any. It's just I don't think any player can yeah, really no, no, beat sure, that. No, no, no. Sure, trust me. Yeah. I know. And Chris G's just so smart. And oh, oh here we go. Nice. Oh. Wow. The Evo Itis. This guy's playing too nervous. The Evo Itis. He's gonna GAC the stalker player. Nope. He's always got missiles. Okay, that's nice. Oh, as you can see. Champ is trying to, to decapitate the Dr. Doom assist. Yeah, he's really aiming for it. He knows that's the heart. Nice, nice, nice roll tag there. Trying to keep that Hulk alive with that Dota Mambo. Yep, he's going to try and fly, see if he can fly. But he's going to have to do this for a long time. Yep, wow. JC. I like that. We might just get that roll tag. Oh. oh! Oh, what are you doing? That wasn't a good decision. Don't chip him off right here. Yep. Yep. I wasn't a bad decision at all to the x because this chip is going to be brutal. Nice oh, air grab there. Got him. And he does not go for the jump jab. Instead, he goes for the easy combo. I feel like these decisions are mind-boggling right now. What are they doing? Yeah, well, I don't know exactly what are they doing. They right are now. playing so nervous. Uh -oh. Morgan, God, that's big, though. Perhaps he wanted to fight Morgan uh, while he's X-Factor. Right now, Chris, see what he's doing right now. He's, wasting, he's getting enough time as possible to land. The last of the match, so Hawkeye can heal fully. Right. Hawkeye's gonna be the only way he can beat Dr. Uh, Domamu. So right now, he's gonna do finger lasers into the spread shot. That's oh, not, not safe. even. Oh, but he got a hit. That was very unsafe, though. Then here come the missiles. Yep. Nice. Very good. That was the last, was very nice. last uh, zone of defense right there. Here they come. Oh, man, this is gonna be too tough for Dr. Domamu to deal with. Gotta respect the missiles. Here comes the stalker flare. Just look at this, man. This is a perfect defense. It is. Wow. Two, two. Oh, and now Champ, you already know what Chris G's gonna do. He is going to switch to Morgan right now. Champ is flipping out over there. He does not want to lose. If he loses, I have a feeling he's gonna be very emotional. Yeah, that's, that's the type of player Filipino Champ is, he's man. He's a very emotional person. It's okay. I understand it as a player when you when you want something so bad, you know, and it gets taken away from you. It's tough. It's tough to swallow. And having a nice little chit chat. He's like, "Well, man, <laughs> it's been a good run." That's pretty much what they say to each other right now. Well, Chad might just be soaking it all in, thinking about it. This could be it for either of them. It has to be it for one of them. Chris G and his pokeball. His pokeball. He got a pokeball on his joystick. Does he? Yeah, no, he does. Look, look at him. Oh, all right. <laughs> oh, Chris man. G. Shout out to his mustache. Shout out to, of course, once again, a spooky and haunts. I play one in the building. This guy's a host holding it for down. this evening right here for the finals. I have seen you guys. And of course, my man, Magus. One, two, three, four. That's right. Uh, you guys, uh, 
you know, go ahead and follow us on Twitter right there if you feel like it. But uh, I wouldn't worry about that too much right now because this match is going to settle it. East Coast versus West Coast. Chris G versus Filipino champ. They're both up two matches. This one, they are coming from losers. This one's going to settle it, and the winner's going to go on to fight in Britain Grand Finals. Now, this is, this is, this is what I'm going to tell you right now. Chris G wins this. It is a very high chance he's going to win this tournament. I agree. Now, if Chan agree. wins this, I think he got Ifrit downloaded kind of to a science. Yeah. But it'd be like a 50-50. Yeah. Got the missile hit. Chris G with first hit. Uh-oh. And he gets the TAC. Here we go. Champ's going to have to hold this one. Oh, my God. Lots of meter. That's all meter. And TAC so we'll back. Get that roll tag. tag into no mama. I see it. No. OK. He's going to the crown. He's going to try and run this out. Now he has to. Ooh. Wow, very evasive. And it's gone. Now he's got to fight somehow. He's got to do something with this little time. Because that roll tag. He's not. He's just fighting oh. for some reason. Dead. Chris G unscathed. And look at that. Raw tags in a, a Hawkeye. Preemptively ready for a Dolomu. Oh. oh. He got too close. Nice aerial counter by Chris G, though. Yep, can't hit all those TACs. I like that smart move of Chris G. He, he got him. You got an X Factor? No. Puts out the stock play. He could react. Yep. Not with that one though. He could have done Gimlet. I'm not Ooh. sure why he didn't react. Oh, does Gimlet lose? Nah, it doesn't. It doesn't go through. Okay, gotcha. And here we go. Pillars. More pillars. Watch out for that flame carpet. Yep. Again with that flame carpet. It hits low. Uh oh. Oh man. Champ is doing his thing right now. Oh, and that is still on the screen. Yep, wow. It just did not go away. You can run, but you can't hide. And Meteor is my interrupter. Yep. Champ jumps back. Dark Matter smacks her in the face. He's going to chip her out unless he X Factors. Now, Champ going to set up a mix up. Teleport. He randomly X Factors for whatever reason. He didn't feel comfortable. Oh, my God. This match is chaotic. This match is too much. Morgan bouncing around. Both of them. He gets the hit. What does she get from the throw? Super? It's not enough. But she gets to stabilize the match. Champ, all oh, the meteors are going to hit her. Champ gets to wake up the free. Gets oh! off the How is he going to finish this? Wow. Oh, Chris no. That's big. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Magus. I don't know. I think this might be it, Yipes. This might be it. This might be the end of the road for our favorite, for the favorite of the tournament, Filipino champ, unless he makes something amazing after he hit a both. Wow. He's doing it. Oh. Oh! Huge! Filipino champ with the comeback. Wow. He should have just took the death. He should have just took the hit. You're absolutely right. But Morgan still got help. Oh, no! With the missile. And Champ is going for chip damage. He's got to watch out. Morgan has an invincible super. He does it. Wow. Champ does it. Unbelievable. He should have just let Morgan die. Yes. But, I mean, I know what's going on in his head. He would have hard tag, hit him in the air, and he would have just rolled on the ground. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But he actually landed, got hit, and on then the Champ street, got no. a full combo. Unbelievable. I wish I could drop obscenities right now because I just want to cuss. Uh, how sick that match was. <laughs> <laughs> that was unbelievable. Guys. Evo 2012, UMBC 3. We are at the grand finale right now. Yep. In Frit versus Filipino Chip. And Chris G, what a show, man. I thought he had it. Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, on paper, he had it. Maybe he should have set it up the tracks a little differently. Should have did the soul fist a little more before he called the hidden missiles. I just, Champ got a room to land a plasma beam, I feel like. It hit both his characters, and from there, everything fell apart. I don't know why he had, like, if you're playing Morgan, though, you should never give him room to, to, to shoot a projectile off, especially a slow one like that. Man, and Chris G is absolutely disappointed in himself yeah. right now. So let's check this out. <clears throat> this match was just something else, really. Uh, one of the greatest Marvel matches uh, in the history of Marvel. See, he thought, he thought that the, the super was going to hit Dormammu before the fireball got there. And so the fireball could disappear, and then that just went that just went downhill from there. That was a bad choice, but he still did good, I believe, in killed or or uh, yeah, he killed Dormammu. But something really weird at like there was some point in the match that just felt like everything turned around. See, it was going good here, 
He catches a happy birthday. I know at one point in time right now they're about to pop the X Factors. Yeah, very strange X Factor. Oh my God, what a counter fest. I know, right? That was a counter fest set. So here we go. X Factor, then champ. Goes ahead and does an X Factor for whatever reason. This is it right here. So he can survive. Both players can survive the chip. Yeah, that's true. More so Chris G. Yeah. And he gets the grab, and then he sets up the happy birthday after this, I believe. Yeah, this is it. It's about that time. He's going to start stockpiling. He has to block it right here. Here it is. So he kills Dormammu. Doom's taking light damage. Not a lot. Morgan's not that heavy a hitter. And she's hard to really convert it. Uh, happy birthdays. Yeah. So he puts Astro Vision. This match is a lock, basically. Chris G should win. And then he gets this watch. Like, there's this one point where he gets a random plasma, like, right there. there. Goes, yep. And I was like, everything goes downhill from there. Because now he's forced to block all this. Right. And this bad decision. That oh. was a bad decision. Wow. Man. It's so tough right there. I mean, like, you, on paper, you would think this is going to be brilliant. Because I'm going to switch and roll on the ground, take no damage, and be able to DHC back to Morgan safely, and I'll win. Oh, wow, and that set it up, and that did it right there. That was it, that was all she wrote. And Chris G, though, with an excellent before. He had a great season, got like two majors under this belt. I think three, I'm not too sure. Yeah, but he, was, he was good, man. Nonetheless, that was a great season. And it was a sick match. Someone's going to go down in history. Yeah, you know? yeah definitely. So. There you go, your top, one of your top three finalists. Chris G takes a solid third place. Nothing to be mad about, but I know he wanted to aim for hot. For I think so, too. I think after he beat Justin, he was ready to win the whole thing. But Champ was there, and Champ's still in it somehow. So here we got the grand finals. Infrit. Infrit versus, versus Filipino Champ. Wow. I mean, a lot of people call Filipino Champ being in the finals. And I know Infrit is excited, too, because Champ popped off to Infrit. Right. Like, it's so funny that it worked out this way. Exactly. Oh, the stars okay. aligned on this one. Somehow. For sure, Somehow. for sure. So, okay, folks, if y'all know strangers to this, this is three out of five grand finals. Filipino champ has to win two sets, and Brit has to win one. Yes. So it's going to be a big hill to climb for champ. It could be any opponent. Winning six games is hard. Yep. And Brit got to win three. You think he's going to play Phoenix? He might switch it to the mom, I think. I feel like he will. I don't know. You see that Doom second? Oh, see, yes, he switched to Dormammu. I feel like this is the smart thing to do for the Pino champ. You should ride that momentum that he got from Chris G, play Dormammu. It didn't work out. Oh, man, this is going to be wild. Infant's getting a big cheer. Champ's getting some advice from the world crowd. The, the champ is, ch is shouting Infant. They're, they're, they're Champ all, is definitely the villain right now. He, oh, yeah, for sure. He always <laughs> is. Always is. Champ, though, did his thing, too. He had a phenomenal season as well. He did, yeah. And, uh, you know, just winning. He's, he's won some majors, I believe, but also uh, winning Curly Mustache recently and this would be huge. That's true. You know, that would really cement that is his a double, That is a double head, yeah. yeah. Most definitely, man. Now, here we go. Now, I think Infrit is more content on fighting this team than Phoenix. I think it's, like, less stressful. Yeah. But I think Champ's better with this team. Like, yeah. fighting Phoenix teams are so stressful. This. Oh, Man, the confirmation there, but no, yeah. nothing, to, nothing to follow. Ooh. This is your grand finals, folks. Let's tough. get it hype at home. This is tough to call, man. Don't Bang your tables. Hit somebody with a steel chair or something. <laughs> yeah. Let's get hype. Jump on your bed. It's getting crazy. Champ just fishing for one hit. Right now, Champ is playing lean. Yeah, he's playing very late. This is kind of like the way he was playing. Oh, sniped him. Very good. Ow! That does a lot of damage. He's gonna oh, hit, comes, hit, hit. oh, nice. He's going to hit Dormammu. Oh, it hits Magneto. He almost oh, gets a combo. He actually air missed the standing jab. It was, yeah. a, it was a standing jab follow up. Oh, is that how you combo yeah. after that? Okay. Got to fall eventually, Sentinel. Got him. Yeah, that match is no fun. I didn't even notice Sentinel's health was so low. It's gone, though. Here comes uh, Spencer now. Look that side switch, but it's a little too early. Oh, opened up. Knock, knock, who's there? It's Magneto's foot on your leg. And he's just going to go in X-Factor and get him. Oh, he's getting squeezed. Oh, no, we're bringing Domamo. I would have just squeezed him. This works, too, though. 
And he's going to start stocking it up. Finished it up. Yep. Oh, he is stocking it up. Yeah. Call Doom. Oh, all right. Wants Magneto for Snowman. Makes he comes sense. that speed tackle very soon. Yep. There you go. There you go. Oh, nope. Very patient play for both. Ooh, got uh -oh. the hit. Uh oh, wait a minute. Can it happen? He's running out of X Factor though. Oh, mistimes oh. his. Uh, He's like, hold that real quick. Yeah, he mistimed the oncoming pressure. I was like, hold that real quick. He snapped his fingers. Mm -hmm. Champ stretching Champ out. Champ wins game number one. Yep. That's, that's six game encounter. Now he got to win five more games. Oh, man, that's tough. That is tough. And then you lose a couple here and there. You know, like, that's just so tough. Look at Infrared. Yeah, just Infrared. don't touch my head. That's it. <laughs> just don't touch it. He looks the same. I've seen him in every match. No emotions. No emotions. Hey, crack a smile. Please, come on. Just crack a smile. I know. I just feel like he's one of those guards in, like, Germany or whatever, the big hats. <laughs> All right, Champ with first hit. And we've noticed every time Champ gets first hit, it's looked really good for him. Yep. So let's see how this one pans out. Nice. Did it match the hit. Yeah, Infrared knows about that. I mean, he has to. Champ again. Maybe go for a TAC this time. It's off the throw, so I think he should, yeah. Uh-oh. Yep, bring him down. Level three, wow. Man, disrespectful. Yeah, very, uh, would, I don't know, not like Champ. He's usually conservative with his meter. He's, uh, he's down, he, he is here to win. Yeah, right, he's just, now he's just gonna say, screw it, I'm going all the way with things. If I was in for right now, I would expect this character. Yeah, I would too, actually. Oh, man. Was he going for the infinite? Don't tell me that. Why? At a time now. Like, I mean, why would you TAC a set? <laughs> yup, X-Factor. That's how you do it. That's what he should have done. Instead, Champ is doing it to him. Oh, yeah. And now Sentinel's going to come in. And you know what? I love Sentinel. But he's not the type of character to make comebacks. He's an assist. Oh, got him. Get the follow-up. Nice. All right, good job by Infrit. Not Infrit's too bad. definitely not out the game yet. Yeah, not yet, man. Ooh. Got uh -oh. him. What, what, kind of, what kind of trickery he has with Sentinel? Command grab. Oh, normal grab, Sneaky. Oh, he tried to bait the up back and grab him. Oh, he's getting squeezed. Yep. Very simple combo. And to grab his squeeze. And that just made, he's mashing him. Look at him mash. What? He survived that? Wow. Are you serious wow. right now? Sentinel survived a level three. I think that's the first time I've ever seen that. Oh! Oh no. Oh wow. That could have been a. Should have kept this simple. Yep. And he's going to go ahead and finish that. Good job, Big Champ. 2 0. He wins one more, he's gonna reset the bracket. Yep. So Ifrit does not want a 3-0 reset because a lot of times when that happens, it ends up being like a 6-0 set. Uh-oh. Ifrit's taking his time right now, think of a strategy. Yeah, you know, he just wants to put him on ice a little. Yeah. Which is a smart thing to do. Champ might be feeling himself and, you know, Champ, Champ's like, he gets a lot of feedback from how he's feeling and how he's vibing. So if you kind of cool him down, you know, then you can kind of play, get him to play a little sloppier. There goes Papa Choi holding the sun down. Yep. <laughs> you already know. Shout out to John Choi. John Choi, another legend of the of you know, course. Street Fighter community. No stranger to the stage, I'm going to tell you that. Not at all, man. They just got a chair uh, for him with his name on it up there. Yep. <laughs> and here we go. So Champ wins this one right here. He resets the bracket. Right. And that'll definitely bode well for his confidence, too, if he gets 3-0. Ooh, very patient by Infra. Good, good discipline right there. Those missiles, though. Oh, man. So difficult to block. Even though it's a very simple mix-up, it's just high then low. It's hard to block. You can never tell when you're done blocking your crouching That's true. Light. And that's the thing, because they think the missiles aren't there yet, so they're already holding up. Yes. And then their legs get clipped. In the right. Whoa. That was sneaky. I've seen him do that before. Uh-oh. Got him. He can kill Magneto if he chooses. Oh, nice! Got that reset air grab. Nice! That was sick! 
Then some unscaled damage. Infant back in this. And here, gone. Ooh. Here we go. What does he have on incoming door? Mamu goes for it, but, but, but Champ push blocked in an interesting way. A late yeah, push block. Very delayed, yep. yep. Close time and all. He's gonna kill Sen or Dr. Doom, sorry. Oh, wow. It was a bad decision. Yeah, man. it was. I was uh, I don't know, maybe he thought it was gonna be easy to kill Doom, but Champ actually moved to turn him around. True. No X Factor. Does not respect that no enough to waste the X Factor on him. That's for damn sure. Nobody yeah, does. Nobody really. does. Now he's gonna play very safe. He does not have to fear the Bionicon at all. He does have uh, X Factor. This is gonna be Infant's gonna have or uh, yeah, Infant's gonna have to do it the old fashioned way. That's gonna be X Factor, yep. 3-0 champ resets the bracket. Amazing. Very strong, very strong. Amazing play. He stands up too. And if he would have won Infant the first time, he would have won Evolution. But he did not. So he reset the bracket. And Infrit is still alive. Man, I hope Infrit is not satisfied. Like just you know? like he made it. Yeah, he done. made it and he's done. That's that's one thing you don't want to do when you're in a grand final set like this. Don't ever be satisfied. And I don't think he is, actually. This I champ mean, is I'm a very in, strong player. I'm not right in now. his head, but that, you know, I, you, sometimes you get that feeling from players. I don't get that feeling from him. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's true. All right, I'm, uh, I have no idea what he's doing. Oh, he's summoning the powers. That's what he's doing. He should, he should knock that smirk off his face. This ain't no time to yeah, jump around. I mean, better win this evolution. If this was a different neighborhood, yeah, that's, like, that's, that's what happens when you start stockpiling oh, in real life. Wow. Ooh, pick him up. You stockpiling, you hold that. Wow, and this Magneto's gonna. Wow. Whoa. Drone's there to protect him. Nope. Could have killed him. He could have, but he made a mistake. Good block. Nice. Oh, wow, with the cancel, oh. I like that. Nice, evasive maneuvers by Champ, but he's going to get chipped out pretty soon. That was pretty he nice. Tucked that? No, he cannot. Counters in, that was smart. Nice. That was really good. Jab, uh, pillar. pillar. Oh, the drones actually hit him. Oh, yeah, they hit him. I didn't, I didn't even notice. So here we go. Very tense. Infant had an early good start. Messed it up oh! with some combos, but he gets the happy birthday. He should pop it right here. Right now. Oh, actually, no, 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 never mind, never mind. He got the bionic arm. Nice. And Magneto coming in with 30% health versus his whole team. X Factor. Oh, oh, not a good look. You know, he was uh, preemptively counter X Factoring, I think. And Champ never X Factored. <laughs> and he's going to squeeze him. Can that kill him? Oh, yeah, that'll kill him. Come on, he'll get a launch after. Oh, he dropped the combo. Oh, try to bind an arm right yep. there. Champ still got a lot of X Factor. Nova could die in a couple hits, make it very quick. Is he gonna try and chip him maybe? Yep. No, baited him. Like, I like that, trying to buy some time. That's true. Oh, he's styling. What yep. a Centurion. Very nice. What a Centurion. Oh, power of the Nova. Still alive though. Ooh. Got him. Dashboard Roundhouse. Wow. Two more. Uh, That's what happens when Chance starts summoning stuff in real right. life. Like I don't like the fact that he like sat there for a while. Like he should have just kept going, you know? There we go. He was like, yeah, let me stop playing the big make believe dog. Right, here there we you go. Get your game face on. I don't want to see you smiling. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about? All right, here we go. Ooh, punch wow. Oh. Oh, I thought Magneto was getting hit, but oh. now he opens up Nova and this is big damage. Look at the damage already. See, I think that's a fuzzy guard. I'm not too sure. It is, because he's holding Crouch Block, but his character's still stuck by the Doom Missile yeah, yeah, standing yeah. block. And he's not dead, though. Thought he was going to tackle. Tackle. There's the tackle. Got him with that crouching jab. He's going to stock up. Yep. Well, that was nice damage, though. Look at Doom's health. If he's, if oh, he's, he's getting next back. He's getting snap back if, uh, if, if that champ's getting touched. Nice combo. Oh, that wow, good. that hurt. That took massive that amount took of damage. That took a lot of damage, man. Here comes Sentinel. I feel bad for him. <laughs> Whack bots. Yeah, he's not not too good. I mean, he can do stuff sometimes, but it's not looking too good. 
inching his way in. Oh, he's really just trying to bait him into doing something stupid, but Infant's not biting. It's going to be tough to make a comeback. Uh, he called an assist, which I think is extremely risky. That's true. Yeah. See it again. Look how smart Infant is. Read that. Oh, wow. That was a smart decision there by Infant. That was beautiful. Go, 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 by the, bo the boys, the center drones. Oh, and he put those, he put those bombs out just for you, yikes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, here comes Dr. Doom. Yep, and he's just going to buy time for that X Factor. Both these characters do pretty well for Sentinel. Oh, wow, nice block. Yep. Oh. And there we go. Now he's back to rare form known <laughs> as Whackbot. Oh, man. Let him he was make good. Him like that. Doom is just going to dance around. He knows Sentinel. Oh, Sentinel's going to have a really hard time opening him up if he plays safe. Just chip damage and air throw setups. There's some free chip damage. Sham is playing a little too safe. He needs to kind of make something happen eventually. Wow. wow! What an answer! What an answer! He needs, he needs to. Oh, don't tell me he's gonna chip him out. It didn't. And Champ does not get the follow up. He thought it was gonna be a grab. Instead, it was a powder slap. Oh, he died. Oh. is gonna die. Champ with the comeback. That was bad, man. He should have abused the bombs. You're right. Four bombs. Just abused the bombs. And Champ Infant, takes it. Infant had a rare, rare moment of emotion right there. Actually, shook his head. He was disappointed with what happened. Champ, one, Imprint, one. What a great set already. Takes a sip of water. He's parched. Wow. Takes a breath. <laughs> the score is one apiece. Anyone can win this right now. <laughs> you said it. Anybody can win it. It's, it's okay. One, I lost. One. Just don't touch my hair. <laughs> That's it. I feel like it's okay. It's okay. Champ. He's got to, I mean, he's he feeling good about the win, but feeling bad about his play. That's what I'd be thinking. I don't know why he went for that chip, too. Should have done the, the, the other drones. I don't know why Champ didn't hit a button for like 30 seconds, either. Yeah, that's just, true. Oh, that's just true. like flying around. I'm Should have like, said that much respect. Yeah, way too much respect for Sam. I think he forgot he was whack. Right. Got the magnetic blast, very good at covering that range where uh, Magneto can air dash after to follow it up. You know what, the infant, I think the one thing that's missing in his gameplay, he's not doing enough uh, gravimetric pulse, the shield. That's right, he actually doesn't use it at all. Oh, oh that's nice throw reset, reset by Champ. And he's not going to be able to kill by normal uh, standards, so he's going to have to do some kind of setup with TAC. Oh, wow, actually, never mind. That did a lot more damage than I thought it would. And it puts the meteors down. Nope. Wow, great nice defense. Block. Yeah, great defense by Infrit. Teleport. Uh, Champ is playing a lot safer than usual. Nice and safe. He's going to nail Dr. Doom. Not dead, though. Nice punish, though. That was a good punish. Knocked him out of the Stalker player. Punishes the S. Oh, 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 X -factor oh, 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 oh. Ay, 80K. Yep, another one. Ay, 80K. So long, sucker. Please. Not going to be able to kill him, I don't think. Let's see. One more. Yep. Oh, wow. Oh, raw tag. I like yeah. that. Doom? No, I don't know about that. Should have gone to Magneto. He's coming. Yeah. He's, he's, he's on the look for that. Oh, that was an up grapple. There you go. Oh, no. That's a dead character for sure. Again, all up to Sentinel. No meter needed. In fact, gave him three bars. Now he's got a lot. Yeah, he's going to go all the way to the stalker player if he wants. He can punish that with gravity squeeze, but uh, he's not going to because he knows he can X Factor. Yep. He's going to look for some kind of grab or mix up. That's something he can't X Factor out of. Oh. 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 Punch the mouth. Two loose hits he does not capitalize on. Nice blocking by Champ. Oh. Infrit, very solid set goal. Oh, nice. Ah, wow, that's okay. one down. If he could just land the mix up, blocks it. Good job. And Champ going back to not hitting any buttons. I don't like when he starts doing this. Wow, with the stiff leg. Yeah, he didn't even cancel just it. Just left it in there like, ah. Okay, okay, here we go. Oh, oh. with another stiff leg. Infrit is baiting that foot dive, it looks like, at that range. And he's trying to counter it. 
Oh, Ooh. that could have been it. That could have. At some point, yeah, he's just gonna have to X Factor and fight this. Just X Factor, there you go. Fight the X Factor. Oh, now he's gonna. Oh, what happened? That was a bad decision, but it's not over yet. It's not. He's got 10 seconds and he could do it. Oh! oh! Wow. Wait a minute. Wow. Are you kidding? He's running away, but he gets the oh! back. He makes the good back. Oh! And Infant's at game point right now. Oh. Whoa. Infant is on the hill to win Evolution. What? Wow. What an answer. Unbelievable. What an answer. You can't count anybody out ever in this game. Man, Infant is the hero right now. He is definitely the hero. Oh my god, what's gonna happen here, Magus? Magus, what's gonna happen here? Will good triumph over evil? <laughs> oh. This is too crazy to call. This makes me want to hit somebody with a chair right now. <laughs> I'm so hyped. I'm about to I just, just, flip I'm about this just table. go close my haunts right now for no reason. <laughs> I'm just too hyped. Oh, hit him first. Missiles is getting capitalized. No, missiles uh, interrupt the problem. Oh, hey, uh, hey, hey. Here we go. Here it goes. This could be it. Yeah, this could be it. This, this could, could be, be it. Big. Oh, no. I'm just, oh, he went for the tech. The, the same stuff Champ does, Imprint does that right there, essentially. Can't kill Doom, though. It hurt him. Champ floating around. Has not put on an offense yet. He's trying to shut up Sentinel over there. Comes speed tackle. Oh, he actually could have. Yeah, he's punishing Sentinel. Now both their assists are hurting. Oh! Oh, that was oh, it! Man. That was the standing jab. He keeps missing it. No, he's actually doing medium on purpose. He should be doing standing jab, though. No, I think he's doing the standing jab, but he's doing the sequence too fast. Oh, so, yeah, yeah. maybe he is, but I've also seen him do it in the past with medium, so I don't know. Oh, okay. Look at Champ, just trying to footsie him. Opened up. Here comes that TAC. TAC or might X Factor. Oh, he's just gonna do that uh, TAC. No, TAC, wow. Level three. Get some meter, get a power up, put him in a bubble. Uh oh. And he's gonna have to hold that one. Sentinel, one more time, it's all up to him. How many times am I gonna say this tonight, man? The whack bot. How is the infant doing it though? He's just doing it somehow. Oh, that could have been it. Oh, Again, that could have wow. been it. To now. <laughs> He's getting the loose hits he needs. He's just not converting them into damage. Champ, I think he should go in more. Oh, that's that, that. Yep. Bad decision there. Oh, oh wow. Whoa. Cha cha on him right there. Whoa. Oh, he could have, yeah, he could have gotten panned right there. Ah! Oh, no, Sentinel. What is happening to Champ out there? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What kind of mix up is it? Oh no! Anybody's hitting next back oh, he gets the foot dive! Oh, oh he drops the combo. He's gonna hard drive. drive. Oh! Imprint, for whatever reason, did not hard drive right there. Two to two. The final match of Ultimate Marvel versus Capcom 3 Evolution 2012 Imprint versus Filipino this is Champ. too much. I can't handle this. I can't handle it. I can't handle this. I'm too hyped. I can't. I don't know. Yo, host, don't even look over here. <laughs> don't even look over here. I'm about to just jump over that clothesline. And I've had to use the restroom for the first hour. I sat down, so I've just been like jerking around, moving my crazy. I can't wait. Man. See how this I ends. I am rocking by my chair right now. This is the this, this looks. This, this is, is too standing. much. I can't take it. I'm getting too old for this yikes. <laughs> oh, man. Filipino champ. Miraculous oh, foot dive. The foot dive heard around the world. <laughs> Imprint. Pulling it together. He's playing so calm. He's a professional. And he's getting the chant. I'm sure you guys can hear it. But there's a lot of people at home and in this audience who also want Filipino champ to win. Oh my God. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, here we go. Infrit putting on the action. He wants to go in there early, but Champ gets first in. Any missiles? Nope. They all hit him. How is he going to finish this? He might go for the reset of TAC. Nice. And he broke, broke it. it. Luck is on his side. It's going to hit him. And he punishes Sentinel, too. That was a lot of damage. That was a lot of damage. He's got TAC out. 
but that's unsafe. He has to X-Factor. Oh, he just takes that to the chest. That's one thing that's bad about Sent or, uh, Spencer being second. No safe THCs. Champ is looking really good right now, though Infant still has three characters. Wow. Oh. No X-Factor? I feel like that would have been a good spot to X-Factor. Oh, man. Champ. Champ is doing it right here. Air convert. Oh, he does not know. It's too high in the air for him to figure out how to convert it. More loose hits from Infinite. Oh and that's going to hurt. He's just going to do it. Not dead, though. Ooh. He's still good. He's still good. Can't kill him. Yep. Can't punish it either. It's oh, wow. he kills Spencer. Hard tags out. Domamu, 50% is going to recharge. Wow, that was, that was beautiful. Oh, he got Magneto. Oh, oh and a bad TAC attempt. I might hit him. X Factors to his safety. Here comes two missiles. He has to X Factor to his safety. Now they're just, they're just nice scrapping. Good nice punish. All up to Sentinel. One more time tonight. Oh, he bopped him right there. But this, oh, Calvary set up. What's he going to do for Stormamu, though? Very tricky Sentinel. Imprint just needs the hits, but here come Doom Missiles. This is not going to be fun. Good good maneuvers. Watch out for those. Good job by Imprint. Very patient. Some loose damage here. More Meteors. Oh, this is going to be a nightmare right here. I, that had to be an accident, but covered by Missiles. Jumps out of that mix-up. Champ can't finish it. Random hard drive. He's risking it all on that. And he gets picked up. Champ, 2012 Evolution, Evolution Champion. Champion. Wow. Imprint gets second. You got to give it up to Imprint, though. He no, played he amazing. His thing. He did his thing. But Champ, the favorite, he proved why he's the best in the world at Ultimate Marvel versus right Capcom now, 3. Yep. And he's having a very emotional moment right now. You can't blame him. There you go. Congratulations to Filipino There's Champ. There's NorCal right there. Look at him, man. He's having a very emotional moment. You know, this guy sacrificed so many aspects of his life to get good at this game, like a lot of us have done here. Oh, look at Norka already. You know, a lot of us don't like Champ, but we all kind of love him. It's like, oh, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. he's one Definitely. of those guys. I always want to kick him in the, in, in the, in the you know, the and then you know what? <laughs> right, yeah. But at the well, end of the day, you That's respect him and he's a good guy, yeah. Very emotional. Infant probably too. But I. Infant's just like, just don't touch my head. <laughs> Second place finish, just don't touch it, man. This is truly an amazing tournament. Top eight, every single match was good. There you go, man. You deserve it. You deserve it. He never gave up, man. You can't in this game, not ever. He's going to get I some media his first team up. Yeah, he's just saying, I've been there. Yeah, I've been there definitely. But you know what though? He's actually uh fucking champ, 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 That's the crowd. That's uh that's NorCal for you. I'm not gonna repeat. He's celebrating it a little better than I am though, yeah. because you know when I won mine, I actually broke my leg. Yeah, that was time. funny. I actually broke my leg, literally. I couldn't yeah. even celebrate it. Everybody was like, yeah, oh, <laughs> just like, but Champ got an excellent finish, man. He really went in. Amazing. Very strong yeah. performance, though, by both Infinite and all of our top eight contenders, top 32 contenders, everyone. Everybody did their thing. That's, that's really good. I think, I think this year was great. I think next year's going to be even more nuts. They're going to be better. People are going to be more prepared. I still get the sense that we're not understanding the game yet. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. So hopefully next year it'll be even cleaner, even more hype. Celebrating. Yeah, they came out in droves here, man. A lot of us showed up, they actually didn't do very well uh, compared to last year. SoCal did a lot better than us this year. So uh, it was really, it's really good to see Champ, you know, they all practice with them. We all practice with them, so it's good to see it. That was the good stuff, man. NorCal is celebrating right now. SoCal looks a little salty, but it's okay. That's how we start wars. <laughs> that's, that was, right. that's how we start some nice longevity wars. Yeah. 
know, that was, that was really good. And, uh, but you know what? We're about to present our top eight. Yeah. Magus, I'm going to step off. Yeah, me too. I'm actually going to get out of here. Uh, that was an excellent performance by our top eight. As you can see, they're about to present um, right. their medals they, of honor. Yipes, thanks a lot, by the way, for getting oh, on the mic. Baby. I know uh, it was just kind of last Please. minute. But that's, that's how okay. things work around okay. here. Yeah. So go ahead and follow him at, 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 at C. Yipes, I believe. Is that what it's at? Facebook. At, on Facebook, my fan too. page. There's a lot coming oh, from the Curly right. Mustangs. Right. Here we go. Yeah. Our top eight winners, Magus, I'm out. All right. Hey, Until thanks a lot, Mike. Yeah, definitely. All right. See y'all later. Take care, guys. Also in seventh place, Y two J. Tied for fifth place, it's Walker. Also in fifth place, give it up for Fuchi! In fourth place, it's Combo In third place, give it up for Chris G. <laughs> and in second place, get loud for Infrared. And the winner and new champion, Filipino Chan! Give it up, give it up!